Hi, it's me. I'm back. Also, what the heck is a uh, Valkyrie? Happy birthday. What the heck? Happy birthday. You're added to the list. Um, thank you for that last minute redeem. Also, hi, Rainbow. Hi, Anka. Hi, Dylan. And bye, bye, Dylan. <laughs> hi, Olive. Hi, Alira. Hi, Lily. Hi, Bookish. Hi, Shay. Hi, uh, I think I got everyone. Hi, Creepy. Hi, Ferranti. Hi. Hi, Anamora. Oh my goodness. How are you guys doing? It is so good to see you. How are you? Um, Merry Christmas Eve's Eve is right. Yes, Merry Christmas Eve's 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 Eve. Um, and thank you for the wiggle. No red nose today, no, because, um, I looked all over for, like, a lip stain. I was using lipstick, um, last stream, and it just didn't sit right, because obviously it's gonna slip and slide everywhere. Um, and I don't have anything else, so... <laughs> I tried it with a lip liner that didn't work. <laughs> so it's sad. Me. Um, oh my goodness! All the things at once! Hi, Wovi, and hi, Trouble, and hi, Cell, and oh my goodness, Rainbow, thank you so much for the seven months. Are you kidding me? I can't believe it has been seven months. I um, It feels like I have been here longer. I am so happy to be here and to support your channel and I love to see it grow. Cheers to many more months together. Oh my God, thank you so much. That honestly means the world to me, my love. And your support is incredible and I cannot believe it that you have been here since the very freaking start. That means the world to me, my love. Thank you so much. Um, Dominion is the best that all are tied. Uh, that is correct. Shay, are you enjoying your much deserved break? Yes, tell us, how was your break? And also, yes. Um, thank you for pinning those uh, messages up there. That is really freaking helpful. My mods are going to be the first ones to work today. Um, so Anka and Olive, that is. So that's pretty cool. We do have one more day of socks. So that's good. Um, I have an important question. Oh, shoot. Hit me. Hit me with it. Um, yeah. There's two things that is going to happen today. Two things are going to happen. Also, Justin, hi. Hi. First thing is, at some point, I'm going to have to pee, which is annoying because I'm wearing this. Last time that didn't happen, but today I'm drinking tea, so I know for a fact it's going to happen. Second thing that's going to happen today is <laughs> I'm going to get a package delivered <laughs> and I'm going to have to open the door <laughs> because Mr. Sivery is not home <laughs> and I am not okay with it. <laughs> So I think whenever that happens, I'm going to like panic and like really quickly like take this off and run to the door and hopefully not be late because I, I am too scared. I cannot open the door like this, okay? I can't do it. <laughs> I can't do it. You better wear that. Don't take it off, okay? Fine, I won't. <laughs> Can I at least take this off then? Um, just keep the thing on. I mean, what I mean, that's true. He's probably gonna be walking back to his car already anyway, so you know, it's gonna be fire to the van. Um, you have the rain. Do you have the rainbow sprinkles? No, I do not. I wish I did have rainbow sprinkles, but I do not. Zero fluffs. Okay, it's gonna be good for me. I'll make the postman, it'll make the postman so happy. That is correct. Okay, I should. I should overcome my fear and just leave it on. Okay. You convinced me. Thank you. You know, you could just wear a Christmas sweater or something. Yeah, I could, but you know. <laughs> wear it. It's fine. It's Christmas Eve's Eve. Yeah, true. I'm allowed to be a reindeer. Uh, that is true. Yeah, what am I even doing thinking about this? I can open the door like this. I can do it. Carrot, I would consider not. <laughs> yeah, it'd be a different story if I were wearing my carrot suit, huh? Good morning, Simmery. Good morning. Oh, hi, Gina. How are you? It is so good to see you, my love. Good morning. Uh, no, open the door saying, hey, I'm a reindeer. Bye. <laughs> What's up? I'm a reindeer. Thank you for delivering my blue light filter glasses that work paid for. Thank you. <laughs> Which is actually exciting. Just pretend you didn't even notice. Yeah, just pretend like when he's looking at me like, what? I'll be like, what? Are you not wearing? Why are you not wearing a reindeer onesie is the better question. Um, welcome back, Lily. Yeah, from your date. Um, your date is in like 30 minutes. Lily, 
Oh my god, that's awesome. Show him your tail. Oh yeah, I could. No, that that would be really weird. <laughs> I'd be so excited, but I'd ask him basically to look at my butt. So maybe, maybe not. <laughs> um, what? I just woke up. I just woke up in this. Yeah, exactly. This is what I wear. I had a coworker have to go to the county office where all the big important people work in a polar bear onesie. <laughs> great well if they could do it i could do it right um no don't show him your tail yeah no i won't i won't do that also very last day of socks my friends very last day of socks is today which is a little sad Ooh, it is um a lot lighter these days because all the socks are gone I want to try and guess how many, I uh, want to try and guess, oh my God. Well, if you're asking that question, it's probably gonna be more than like two, right? It's probably gonna be like five. Uh, he just went home to shower, good. He better be uh, fruity and fresh for you, you know? We are going to have our coldest weekend this week. So luckily I have my Udi. Oh, I freaking love your Udi. Have you worn it yet? I. I genuinely, I'm so excited because you got one for your stepdaughter as well, right? I am genuinely so excited to see, like, to know or to hear if they enjoy it. Fruity and fresh. <laughs> yeah, you gotta be. Um, okay, so we have, naturally, the 20... Wait, I think we have... What day is it today? 23rd. I think we have three to open, actually, because this is my last stream before Christmas. Oh, we have three, you guys, because we have yesterday's, today's, and tomorrow's. The Harry Potter one I haven't yet uh, because it's been laying out to dry from washing. Yeah, 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 it it doesn't dry. Like, that, that goes very slowly. <laughs> I can tell you from experience. That's a long time. Um, Ashy, hi, how are you, my love? 13 languages? Oh my god, I wish I could do that. That is impressive, Alira. Impressive as heck. Meanwhile, I'm just opening yesterday's so No! Look at this! Oh my god, that is so cute! <laughs> um, I'm okay. Uh, happy to have the day off. Oh, I'm so excited for you, Ashy. That is so nice. Look at these socks. These are literally little floops. Little floops all over. Oh, that is so cute. I can't. What the heck? Uh, Luna, our great uh, Pyrenees, is seven months and is getting her first look and feel of snow. Oh my goodness, happy seven months. That is so cute. Um, she enjoying it? Yeah, this is literally floop socks right here. That's amazing. Okay. Okay, we gotta keep, we gotta, you know, we, we gotta open the rest because we don't have all day. We have lots of, of shells to tour. Um, where is number 23? It's right here. It is right here. Oh, this looks comfy. Oh my goodness. Oh my God, this is so cute. The color is so cute and they have like little teddy bears. They're basically like regular socks that they're a little thicker and they have like little teddy bears. That is so cute. They're so baby. I know, right? Uh, oh, you have to work two hours. Well, it's better than the entire day, but two hours. You can do this. I believe in you. I'm rooting for you. Look at this. That is adorable. Freaking love it. Such a great sock haul. Really, after this calendar, I'm really going to like throw out all my old socks and I have nothing but new socks now. It's amazing. And then the 24th is a big box. It's the last day. Oh my God, what are you doing? Rainbow, thank you so much for the four gifted subs. What are you doing? That is so incredibly kind of you, my love. You're going to make me cry. Finger slipping. <laughs> no, we do not do that here. Oh my God, I love you. Thank you so much for that incredible support. That is amazing. And 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 Shelby, uh, it's LB and Crystal, Misty Cat, and Olia, 
I hope you guys enjoy the emotes and the ad-free watching. That's amazing. A man who makes you a custom sock advent calendar is definitely a keeper. Oh, trust me. Yes. Uh, love the nail color. Thank you. Hi, Nick. How are you? All Christmassy and stuff. Okay, well, uh, last socks of the calendar for this year. That is pretty, pretty, went pretty fast, I have to say. Oh my goodness. This is so cute. They're mismatched. Oh no, this is so cute. Look. This one is um, yellow with hedgehogs and little apples and leaves on them. And then this one has little apples and they are mismatched, but together. No, that is so cute. That is so cute. I cannot believe it. He knows my vibes too, because this is all like, th these colors are right up my alley. I freaking love it. Um, okay, well, sad but true. This was the calendar. Uh, I feel like Mr. Simri deserves a big round of applause for this. That's amazing. Freaking amazing. Hi, hello, Merry Christmas. I am here, but I am not. Hi, Isabella. It's so good to see you, my love. Uh, how are you today? Merry Christmas Eve's Eve today. Merry Christmas Eve's Eve. I'm a fancy I'm a fancy man. Okay, and there we go. Well, that was the socks, you guys. Crazy. I love this. Um, he does. He did well. He really, really did. More calendars, please. Yeah, we'll have to do a different one for next year. Um, different stuff in it. This was great, though. Freaking love this calendar. Okay. Let's get started with these shell tours, shall we? We have like 12 to go through, so this is gonna be a while. Um, he must have had so much fun finding all these socks. I know, I wasn't allowed to open any mail for the past like month and a half because he was like, it's gonna be socks, so you better not open. It's been so funny. Okay. Uh, the time for you? You're in Australia, right? Isn't that, wait, am I saying, is that really random? I, I, I might be re misremembering this. I can't wait to see the shells either, Shay. I'm so happy you're here today. Okay, so first up actually today, let's reconnect because this is going to keep happening, is Anka. Let's go. Oh, I, I was so scared that the gallery wouldn't work for us today, but it's working. So knock on wood, but I think it's going to be, I think we're going to be fine. Um, here you are. Oh, Santa's workshop. No, this is so cute. Uh, in Santa's workshop far away, the little gnomes work night and day working hard to make the toys for all the good girls and boys. The head gnome checks twice and looks as the last one packs the last few books. As Santa, uh, Santa uh, packs them in his sleigh, ready for us all on Christmas Day. Turn off my reshade, by the way. Uh, <laughs> I just finished the rhyme by accident. <laughs> you rhymed it. Oh my God, Anka, this is so cute. Working gnomes, oh my God. This is so cute already. Okay, so you built it on a 30 by 20. This looks like new crest to me, but honestly, doesn't really matter. Uh, Furnish, let's go. You will be my background sound while I'm preparing for guests. I love you all. Merry Christmas. I will miss you. Can't wait to see you after Christmas. Isabella, have the most amazing magical Christmas, my love. And thank you for uh, for having us as your background noise while you prepare. I hope you have the most magical time and the most fun. Um, love you, love you, love you, and can't wait to see you after Christmas. Have your sims ever pooped their pants, then died from mortification? Mine have not, but I know it can happen. I know it can happen. Um, <laughs> poop their pants though? Do they do that? Or do they just die from mortification? That is so dramatic. It's so dramatic, isn't it? 
Why are Sims like that? You missed mine, but I hope you got a chance to watch the VOD. Oh, yeah, you need to see one minions. Because uh, she did three. Three shell challenges on one lot. Three. She repeated the same shell three times and then went wild with it. It was so good. Um. Hi, Katie. How are you doing? It is so good to see you. How are you? Uh, I would do the same, honestly. Yeah, well, me too. I would poop my pants and then die. Yeah, it's something I would do. Um... Where did we leave my sim? Where is the lady? I think she's here. Um, no. I think she might be... Oh, she's here, I think. I think Johanna's was the last one. Right, right, right. Uh, hi! Oh my goodness, how do you, how do I pronounce your username? SKO4, hi, how are you? Welcome in. Uh, oh my god, well, Minion was smoking something and not sharing when she did the shelves. <laughs> Correct. That is, yeah, I stand by that. Um, Newcrest. Santa's workshop. It already looks so cute. I cannot wait to see this. <laughs> yeah, three times the decor. I know, it was pretty, pretty insane. Be like SpongeBob and be proud to poop the pants. Yeah, yeah, be proud to poop the pants, you know? I, uh, I agree with that. I have never pooped my pants. I mean, probably when I was a child, but never pooped my pants before, actually. Ooh, this looks already, this looks so cute in the fall as well. Let's go into build mode, actually, because it's dark here. Um, okay. What the heck? This looks so cute. Are you seeing this landscaping? No. You merged these trees together? I am just now noticing that. Oh my god. That is so smart. What the heck? Yeah, the lights. I'm speechless. That is so smart. Oh my god. There are so many details. Oh, I I'm sorry. I'm I'm literally obsessed with these trees that you merged together. That is so beautiful. Okay, I want to see better. Are you seeing the side of this house? All these windows with the flower boxes and this landscaping? Oh my God, what is this? Is this a weather machine? Yeah. And all these toys back here? I am literally speechless, literally. What pack are the trees from? Um, the trees with the lights in them, I'm fairly certain are from the free holiday pack, right? Um, yeah, from the free holiday pack, actually. <laughs> or did you mean this one back here? This one, I, I'm not sure. I think it's Bramblewood. Okay, so it's from, oh, oh, this might be base game but you got it for free with the early release or no the the the, the pre-order of cottage living something like that so it's base game but really it isn't um yeah it is it's two trees she merged two of them together that is freaking smart as heck but they don't have leaves exactly which is the one thing they're missing i feel like i mean in the winter time not all trees most of the trees don't have leaves but this is like it gives it so much more... I don't know, I just freaking love it. It's stunning. Um, 
Yeah, it looks seamless, exactly. Okay, so what do we all have? We have my family back here. Oh my God, look at him. <laughs> this gnome is living his freaking best life. <laughs> That's awesome. Um, and then we have one down here as well, living his best life. And then, ooh, buddy, you gotta be careful. Careful now. Um, oh, so cute. All this landscaping, I'm sorry, that is insane. And these little chairs and all the vines that you placed as well. Okay, so you use this as a chimney. Um, yes, really, really cute. With the roof pieces on the side, I love that. Let's go here. So we have these cute decorations and then there is um, a chess table back here as well. Oh, so cute. Um, took me a while. Oh, I can only imagine. Uh, which you totally stole from, oh, the roof pieces, did you? Yeah, I love doing that. Um, and then let's go and look at this. I'm sorry. Oh my God. So here is a little workshop with all the cute look. There he is. Hi. Hi, buddy. Look at his little nose. He is so cute. And then these, oh, you use the flower arranging tables. That is so smart because they have like little drawers in them. Yeah, right. And then there's all these toys and all these um, like shoes and presents and stuff. Even this cart is filled with toys. No way. There is no way. I love that rupees thing on the chimney. Um, it was awesome seeing people do that over the last couple streams. Yeah, it's it makes such a difference, right? So we have a little cabinet filled with toys. Oh, so cute. And then obviously a Christmas tree. And then back here, some more workbenches. Oh, so that is so smart actually to use the um, like flower ranging table. And this is the candle making station as workbenches. Oh. Oh my God, I think that that, hang on, hang on. is like pounding <laughs> I know this man um sometimes it's a different one but I recognized him and he recognized me and I opened the door and he just smiled <laughs> Whew, sorry I scared you but it was worth it oh bookish it was it was worth it yes you really got me it was all the things at once because right when you scared me um the doorbell rang as well so that was uh <laughs> everything at once oh my goodness i leave for one second and she's gone yeah oh good job we're proud of you thank you that was a rush this is um as adventurous as my life gets um i would say so yeah this was a big event for me that was a big event that was a legendary scare i know <laughs> um oh okay not me just walking the dog in my bed. <laughs> oh, really? That's awesome. I love that. Did the postman have any comments? No, he just, I opened the door and he like hesitated for a second and then he smiled and he was like, here you go. I was like, thank you. <laughs> and he was like, bye. <laughs> so funny. Um, okay, well. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Ooh, okay, so 
I love like the level of detail. What the heck is this? No. What? I am legit so confused right now. Oh, this, this comes, this is part of this workbench. I have never looked at this workbench for more than like two seconds at a time, I don't think. Um, it's attached to the thing. What the heck? I never, I never noticed that. That's crazy. Okay, so we have this cart full of presents. I freaking love that. Here we have another gnome doing his thing, working on the games. Love this. The cluttered shelves as well with the tools and everything. That is, that is adorable. They I am just now noticing this little pot with um, brushes in it. That is most definitely a recycled flower pot from the little succulents from Discover University. I have never noticed that before. Yeah, the little gnomes as elves, you guys, is so creative. I would never think to do that. This one can fly, you see? That's really pretty useful, actually. Um, and you work with platforms as well, because here we have a little step up. Um, that is so cute. And then they have like a little fireplace here. The fact that you used a chess table, like in between these chairs, is the literal cutest thing. And I have never thought to do that before. This gives me Harry Potter common room vibes. Yeah, it really does. You almost died doing so. <laughs> that is not good. Um, <clears throat> yeah, that is freaking adorable. I agree. And here we have one going a little bit crazy with all the yarn. Um, maybe I can only imagine him like sitting here, like singing really loudly. He's like singing Christmas carols really, really loudly out of the knitting basket. Um, and then, oh my God, we have two of these letter thingies stacked. Yep, that's good. Um, more gnomes. We have the lost um, uh, Easter bunny gnome as well. And uh, the amount of clutter, look at all this detail. Literally every single surface looks so well thought out up to these like bags behind these plushies here absolutely insane love this pillow underneath the tree as well dollhouse more toys this is insane i'm sorry what the heck and then what is behind this door oh a little bathroom of course that is so nice. Even this is like so detailed. Um, This must have taken forever to place everything, right? How long did this take you? Okay, and then we go upstairs and here we have a little, oh, it's lofted. Look at that. It's lofted. Are you kidding me? That is so pretty. A while. <laughs> Thank you, Nightmare, for the wiggle. I really appreciate it. I'm in love. Yeah, what the heck? It's lofted. I'm I'm literally like dying inside. So we have a little a little um kitchen that is absolutely freaking pretty with a coffee maker and a teapot, kettle, whatever. And these little uh s'mores. Oh, I could go for a s'more right now. That's nice. That's nice. With milk and cookies, right? Oh my goodness. It is so cute. And then we have this um, little four seater table and this nightstand. Yes, please. All the clutter. Um, a little wreath back here as well. And then there is a door. Hang on, hang on. We need to check out this because I saw clutter on this stool as well. Yeah, that's adorable. This chair, I keep saying it, but it just works so well for these builds. And I love the werewolf's windows here as well. That's adorable. And then out here we have oh, a little balcony. Love the placement of this, that you just placed it like on the floor as opposed to under, a, as like as a window box. 
Um, GG, hi, how are you? Um, yeah, that is so cute. Hi, Jessica. I don't think I actually properly said hi to you yet. Stealing that too, yeah, do it. You better have your notebooks ready. Um, we can look at the stars out here as well. And Cat Lover, thank you so much for the follow. Hi, how are you? A Merry Christmas Eve's Eve, if you celebrate. Um, need to uh, step up my building game. Oh my God, no, Rainbow, shut up. You don't get to say these things. You don't get to say these things. <laughs> I will ban you. <laughs> You're so good. Um, I also use the rat OMSP, you know, my big friend. Right, right. How is it going with that? Um, did you like get the hang of it? Okay, so I want to admire this roofing also a little bit more before I move on to the backyard. Um, this is freaking adorable. I love this. And the balcony is such good placement. Okay, so. I think this, I think, oh, what happened is the um, staircase snapped up to the, um, platform on the inside. It does that to me as well, but that's okay. That is the gallery doing it. Um, Tofu Queen, I love your username. Thank you for the follow, my love. And Ashling, hello, how are you? Welcome. Uh, Ashling, yay. Okay, I think Ashling, with you doing, uh, yes, thank you for adding. S for some reason, my mods are in my, um, are in this document adding the, the people. And some one of you is called Anonymous Kiwi. <laughs> I don't know why, but it's really funny. Um, uh, and uh, is Isaac Fia? Oh my goodness, how do I pronounce that? Thank you so much for the follow, my love. Hi, welcome in. I love the slightly overgrown looking landscaping. Yeah, that's gorgeous. Um, but I think I actually honestly think that we need to close the entries now. Otherwise, I won't have time to get through them all. Um, <laughs> this is the last stream we're doing, so. Um, I don't know how to show my name for the, no, that's okay. Um, yeah, one of you guys is just anonymous user, and then the other one is anonymous Kiwi, and I quite enjoy this. I, I like it. Um, Agreed. Okay, so we'll see that the entries are close now. Let's do that. Because honestly, <laughs> it's going to be like a six hours of grief. Um, you, on yours, it's Anonymous Jackal. Oh, yeah? I wouldn't do any more. You have a deadline that you never follow. That's so true. <laughs> so true. I just want to see everyone's. It is so exciting. Um, let's take a look at this little backyard because I freaking love it. We have a wishing well with a uh, washer thingy that is actually so, makes so much sense that this would be placed. Like you get the water out of the well and then, yeah, yeah, you're smart and I, I'm not. Um, and then we have this oh, little gnome, the ghosty gnome on the picnic bench as well. And we have the swing set. I love how you like did all the landscaping, but then you placed like potted plants with that as well. It looks so seamless. It's awesome. Um, how many did you tour last stream? How many more do you have? I think we did nine. Um, we did nine next or past stream, but Wominions included. So that was basically three <laughs> um and now we have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen <laughs> okay i need to get a move on i think um yeah it's you uh i think the mods are going to put the hammer down for next shell so we can keep it organized without simri getting in our way i think that is a good idea <laughs> i am so happy to have you guys Oh my God, um, you're taking over, yeah. Okay, so can we please have a massive, massive round of applause for Anka? 
This is so good. You don't even understand how good this is. This is so good. And um, just like last time, what was your favorite thing about this shell? Put it in the chat for Uncle to read. Um, Favorite part is view from the loft looking down in the first floor. I I was gonna say that. My favorite part about this build is um, it's so difficult to pick one thing, but I think the fact that it's lofted like this makes it feel so unique and like it really helps with the whole like workshop vibe. It's just, oh, I freaking love that you made it lofted. And then also all the clutter and all the colors together are just, it's just stunning. Stunning. Um, the exterior, nice. The loft was your favorite, yeah. The tree merge, oh yeah. Oh my God, yeah. Okay, all of it was my favorite part, thank you. Um, yes, thank you for, for submitting this. Oh, it's such a joy to look at. The chest table placement inside, yeah. That was smart, I am stealing that. This was very much out of my comfort zone. So thank you, really? It feels like this, it feels so like effortless in the sense that it just feels like this came so naturally to you. It's so good. Um, um, but I'm happy to hear that you had, I mean, it was probably such a pain at parts as well, but I'm happy to hear that you like stepped out of your comfort zone and like tried something else. That's so cool. Okay. Olive, you're up. You are up. So what we're gonna do now, actually, I might try if it's still snowy in Willow Creek. Otherwise, if it's not snowy anymore, we'll put it in the we're snowy part of Snowy Olive. Escape. Um, that's true, which was Anka's idea, very smart. This is on a 30 by 20. Um, I don't think this is, oh, this is in the vampire world. Wait, you can't look at the tower until after the house. Oh my God. Did you want me to place it in uh, Forgotten Hollow? Cause it's not gonna be snowy if we do that. Yeah, it's just that if if, if things are not snowy on the gallery, then I, I take it. Oh, sorry, have to read the description, of course. Um. Maybe you don't want it snowy and then it's, we can place it anywhere, but. Uh, okay, so let me know. Would you rather have it snowy or would you rather have it in Forgotten Hollow? Uh, this house has been in the Johnston family for generations. Robert, Catherine, and their 14-year-old son, Henry, were the last to live here. As far as everyone was aware, they were a normal, happy family. Christmas morning came and the Johnstons woke up excited to spend the holiday with each other. However, they never made it downstairs and they were never seen again. The house has sat abandoned for decades. What happened and why is no one ever allowed in again? I'm so scared right now. What if this roofing? Okay, 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 I'm placing it. I'm, I need to place this. <laughs> this is creepy as heck. I love this and I hate it at the same time already. Super creepy and I love it. <laughs> you guys are so creative. I can only agree with that, yeah. Glad I'm catching this one live. I've been wanting to see the abandoned Christmas house. I am excited, but super scared at the same time. Super scared, okay. If it's snowy in the gallery photos, yeah, then place it in Mount Kamurabi, exactly. If it isn't snowy, then place it in the same world. You have lost, yes, exactly. I think that's a great idea, Wo Minion. Yeah, that's what we'll do. Uh, yeah, just in a base roll. Yeah. Okay. Um, getting you out. Watch it be snowy. Here <laughs> in live mode too. <laughs> Uh, mine looks snowy, but isn't snowy. I added snow piles around it, but it looks better out of the actual snow. Okay, good. Good. 
Uh, this makes up for my lame Halloween house. Shut up. I will literally time you out for a second and then you'll lose your sword. Do you want that to happen again? Do you want that stress again? Because I will put you through it. I will put you through it, my friend. Um, I kind of want to look at this in the dark. Is that okay? <laughs> I feel like that makes sense. Why is it 3 a.m. though? Hi, AJ, how are you doing? It's so good to see you. The tower in the back, so I'm not allowed to look at that yet. Oh no, the snowman, what happened? No, buddy, are you okay? Um, Amazing Girl Gamer, hi, thank you for chatting with us. This looks nothing like the shell, I know. I. What? What is this roofing? Why is it so amazing? What the heck? I'm so confused. <laughs> this looks so good. Okay, but buddy, are you okay? Um, I freaking love that every single build have has this uh, little reindeer decoration. That's such a theme. You're still sick. Oh my God, sending you all the love and the good vibes for a speedy recovery, my love. It's abandoned. Things fall. True. I'm, I need the tool mod, but it scares me. I get it. You'll get you get the hang of it, though. It scared me for the longest time, and then I decided to just install it. Turned out it wasn't so bad. I'm still getting used to it, but I feel like I've been getting pretty all right with it. Um, I love the decorations in the roof and this little lantern as well. And it, oh, they did decorate the house so nicely. It's so beautiful. Let's go around. Oh, look at this sunroom. It's all overgrown. Oh my God. Oh, chair fell down. So much grass. Another chair. Ew. Dirty bucket. Also, my sim is overheating, but that's not my problem. Um. Okay, I need to not look at the tower right now. No, the, uh, go take care of it. <laughs> go take care of it, Olive. Tool is a must. Yeah, what is the tool mod called? It's literally the tool mod, but it's like T dot, like, it's, it's spelled like this. Um, This is incredible, what the heck? I know, all the grass. Look up Twisted Mexi, right? Yeah, it's by Twisted Mexi. Okay. Um, why is no one allowed inside is the question. Let's go check it out. So here we have an entryway. Oh. First of all, this freaking floor plan is amazing. This hallway with a staircase in the middle is such a good use of space. It like divides up the house and it's so pretty. You can really see that this used to be such like a wholesome family home, but now it's all abandoned and scary. But it has, it used to have the wholesome vibes. It took you forever. Yeah, I can see that. Look at all the cobwebs too. So we have this entryway with the clutter um, and all the cracks in the wall and I'm stuff. A fancy set. A fancy uh, man. Yeah, I spotted him too. <laughs> Look, he's right here. I feel like my first floor was so much smaller. Right, this feels so big. Oh no, Mr. Simri, are you okay? Are you okay? Um, and here we have another nice... I love these curtains in here too, by the way. And I love the lighting in here. It's so like moody, which is good. Um, let's go check out the living room area. I'm sorry, but I am so tempted to use this for like a renovation. I want to make this cute again and wholesome for a new family. I don't know why the candles are on the floor. Well, you know, they fell, <laughs> I guess. I don't know. Um, I know, right? Where did all this room come from? Yeah. Look at this little study nook with this desk. Is that from werewolves? I don't have an active memory of this. Um, oh my God, all the presents with the cobwebs. Oh, 
this living room is so cute and the 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 paintings such an amazing job your playtest sim left a book out i don't even know what you're talking about oh right there i didn't even see that it's fine <laughs> i love this i love this sunroom all overgrown but then with the rocking chair Oh my God, that is so freaking cool. And then here we have the kitchen, right, 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 right. Oh, I love this layout for the kitchen. Um, I don't know what is in this uh, fridge, but uh, I take it it's not super fresh anymore. Um, that's disgusting. All these stains. This is building goals, I know. Look at that. Oh my god, the clutter. This milk carton. Ew, that must be so smelly. Um, a fruit cake, another book. I love this kitchen. That is really cute, actually. Oh my god. Yeah, you need to give yourself all the credit in the world because this is honestly so cute. <gasps> Look, you also put the bows on the door like Isabella did. I love that. Why did I never think of that? That is so cute and such like a cute, like elegant little touch. Um, okay, so here we have the bathroom. I love this placement of the toilet and the counters. And then the shape of this is so wacky, but you made it work so well. That's amazing. That truly is amazing. I would never think to make this space this shape, but it works so well. Um, I am scared for what is in the chimney. Honestly, me too. <laughs> oh, okay, let's go up. So here we have a landing. Love this too. Oh, really, really nice. All the clutter in the shelves and what happened here? Um, don't know. Um, I think the branches inside make sense. Uh, wall holes, I'm sure. Yeah, I think it makes perfect sense. It's amazing. It like merged with the house or something. And now there's holes in the house and like everything is like growing inside. I don't know, it makes sense to me. Cause this looks like an old house. Like this is a long time ago. Love this bedroom with the clutter on the bedside tables. And then again, all the cobwebs. I am just happy there is no spiders this time. Cause uh, I don't know if you remember. <laughs> Last time with the shell challenges. Oh my God, with the tours. Um, Yes, dresser clutter. Yes, again, painting falling down. Yes. I know, I kind of want to live here too and flip it. That would be so, so satisfying. Yeah, it's actually fantastic. Okay, and then here we have a kid's room. Oh my God. I wonder if the fish is still alive. Oh my God, the fish is dead. <laughs> You actually put a dead fish. <laughs> that is so disturbing. <laughs> Press play and stare at the cobweb. No. I don't see, I don't see spiders yet. They're not here. Um, wait for it. Oh no. <laughs> I love this room, by the way. Um, and then here we have a little bathroom. Also really cute, actually. Candles on top of the toilet. Yes, yes. I'm I'm a little bit scared for the spiders, but I don't see them. They're not popping up yet. The circle one. The cobwebs on the mirror, by the way, also. So pretty. Um, okay, so here we have a little balcony. Really cute. Um 
We have a little gnome up here and then we have a chess table as well. I love these chairs. That's so pretty. And um, I think we're going to have to take a look inside the tower now. They aren't working for some reason now. Let's check down here. They're not popping up today, which I honestly do not have an issue with. <gasps> <laughs> oh, I hate them. Oh, I hate them so much. <laughs> That's so gross. I hate them so so much like uh I, it makes me sweaty <laughs> great timing again yeah <laughs> yeah that happens all if that does mm, uh, uh, i hate spiders so much i need time to recover and there is a mouse hole too oh yeah oh my god i hate them so much Oh, oh, why do I keep looking? I don't know why I do that to myself. Um, okay, so we're going to see what's in the tower. Look, no, <laughs> what are you doing here? <laughs> um, you were waiting, oh my God. Sorry, I'm sorry, sir. Who are you? Who is this? What is this item? I have never seen that in my life. The closed off door is so freaking cool. Um, never see this thing. He is Santa. Well, he gives me creepy vibes. Dead Santa? Um, okay, so we have paintings up here. That is pretty, seems pretty normal to me. We have some attic stuff and some paintings and some canvases. I don't know, thought it was creepy. Well, yes, yes. He, he, he is creepy as hell. I'm done. I'm not coming back. All of you're fired. Goodbye. Merry Christmas, everybody. Just kidding. I'm coming back. I'm coming back. Um. <laughs> Where is Titanic? Not there. That's weird. Oh, there we go. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> What the heck? I was gonna say, I haven't seen, I have seen lots of gnomes, but I haven't seen the gnomes. The gnome, you know, but um, yeah, found them. And I think we found the family too. Um, rest in pieces. Literally. You're unalive. <laughs> Did the gnomes kidnap the family? Yeah, what the heck? I will never look at my favorite gnome the same way ever again. He is not cute anymore. Never mind, you ruined it for me. This is absolutely amazing. It is, in the creepiest freaking way. What the heck happened? <laughs> this is such a cool idea. It is. It is really creative. Gnome's gotta do what a gnome's gotta do. <laughs> yes. The mom.
Kong bought one gnome and then they took over. Yeah, they have been uh, uh, reproducing in the attic, it seems like. Glad we saved the tower for last, yeah. <laughs> this truly made my day as well. This is so cool. Um, Merry Christmas, everybody. Merry Christmas. <laughs> I will never look at a gnome um, in a garden the same way again. I know. Rip Johnson family. Yeah, it's so sad, but so cool. Okay. Can we please get a massive, massive round of applause for Olive? This is so good. So good. I can't even begin to express how much I love this and hate this at the same time. Um, yes, please stand up, take a bow because uh, what the heck? Um, I don't even know where to begin, but everyone name your favorite thing about this. I think my favorite part was not the spiders. My favorite part was, I mean, it has to be the situation in the attic. It has to be. But other than that, I love how you make the house look so homey and cozy at the same time. Like the entire storyline that you went with is portrayed so like chef's kiss throughout this entire build. It's so good. It's like heartbreaking. It's like so cozy, but then something terrible happened and you can tell, you know, like it's really, really, really good. Um, Just the concept, cause yeah, right. The gnomes are hard to ignore. Yeah, well done. This is the best storytelling. I'm a little scared of all <laughs> I love that they made it a haunted house. Yeah, Van, it's so like, out of the box for a holiday build. My goals, cozy and creepy. Yeah, you really nailed that part. I like the little overgrown sunroom in the back. Yep, yep, yep. Did you want to see more spiders? <laughs> Is that what you want, well, minion? Mm. Uh, I can't look. Oh my God, I hate it so much. Oh, I was almost gonna say a bad word. <laughs> um, You just know there is something not, yeah, right. It's his house now. <laughs> yes, I think so too. And I do not agree with it. Um, FAQ, <laughs> right. I hate it too, if it helps. Yes, that's good. That does help. Okay. Uh, yes. Freaking amazing. I freaking love everything about this. Yes. Thank you. Oh God. <laughs> Did you clip that? That's good. <laughs> um, actually, next up is Dylan. We all know Dylan isn't here right now. Dylan had to leave. He did check in, but then he needed to leave. That's okay. We're going to look at him for him. He's lurking. Yeah, good. Okay. Um, I need Mr. Simri to create a spider emote. Oh, that is actually a good idea. We can make it creepy. We can make it creepy and like animated. Ew. Yes. Okay. I think that's a pretty good idea, actually. Um, okay. <laughs> Why am I not seeing Dylan? Uh, there are emotes on better TV. Yeah, but I don't think everyone sees them. Yeah, it depends on if they, if you have it uh, installed, the thingy. Not everyone sees them. Uh, EA. Huh, 
I don't think he, I don't think it's up. Um, Dylan, if you're here, I don't think he's here actually. Well, I mean, he's lurking, but he might be AFK. Um, yes, Megs, hi, have a good lurk. Thank you so much for being here. I really appreciate that, my love. Maybe check include custom content, yeah. I've lost my phone, which is on silent, so I'm gonna find that now. Oh my god, yes! I hope you find it. That's always so stressful when you when you like can't find your phone. Um okay, I think we're just gonna if Dylan comes back later, we'll ask him if he managed to put it up on time. Um and then for now. I think we're just gonna go with, uh, oh, this is, uh, Alric. Wait, that is, that, I think that's Honey May. That is Honey May's EA ID, I think. Let's see. Yeah, 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 it's right here. Look, it's May. I think she's actually streaming right now. Wait, is she? I don't know. Um, yes! Oh my god, yes! Put the maze in chat, please! Uh, maybe it's in your hands. Check them. <laughs> it happened to me with glasses before. Uh, I don't see her. Okay. Oh wait, no, it was Kai. Kai was streaming. Um, that's what I got a notification from. Okay, so May isn't here, but that's okay, because we all know that her build is going to be freaking amazing we're gonna put it in it's snowy so let's put it in hi baby hey did you want to come here did you want to come up my love you're so lazy today honestly that's okay because it is the weather is freaking terrible um okay we'll put it let's put it here why not baby oh she's going under the rug Right, right. I'm using my mom's phone. It's definitely not here. Huh, that is so annoying. It's raining cats and dogs. It is, it's really, really, really bad. It's saying it's gonna end soon though. Um, are you okay down there? Are you okay? Are you living your best life? Tearing up the carpet? You're allowed to. It's kind of what I bought it for. For you to tear it apart. Huh? Um, okay. It's official. We have a blizzard warning. Oh my god, trouble. Be safe, please. Be safe. That is, uh, that is pretty scary. Found it! Yay! Good. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. May is so talented. Hi baby. Did you want to come up here or are you going to stay down? Baby. Do you want to come say hi to the people before Christmas? She cannot be bothered. Maybe later. This is so cute. Yeah. May is so talented. This is so pretty. I love the gray siding with the brick and everything. That noise is floop tearing apart the carpet. Look at this roofing and the chimney. The roofing looks so like effortless. <gasps> and these lights here as well. That is so pretty. Oh my god, and the little snowman. Okay, let's go inside. The roofing, yeah. Um, Honey May, uh, on the list she is Alaric, the one uh, after Dylan. What? Hi, baby. Oh, you're literally going under the carpet now. Yeah, okay. Um, I am just in awe with everyone. Me too. This is insane. Okay, so we have a little entryway here with a staircase. Very nice use of space. Oh my god, a, sho a snow shovel? 
A show snuffle? <laughs> That's what I was gonna say. A show snuffle? What? At least after today you're allowed to see my video. Yes, I've been waiting for that moment. Um, it's like torture. I'm so curious. This is beautiful. I know. If you have better build by, you can press tab and look in first person mode. Yes, I can. I want to, but I also kind of want to like get a feel of the overhead like um floor plan, is it? Hi. <laughs> Why? What is it? Did you want to come up here? She's just talking to me. Um, okay, so wait, off to this. Oh, look, skis as well. That, oh, hi. There she is. Did you look at, is your bed not good enough for you? Did you want to sit here? And she's down again. Okay, yep. Yep. I really need to dive into a little just for things like hanging the shovel. Yeah, it's really, really, really smart. I would never think to do that. Um, so we have a little bathroom down here, super cluttered and cute. Um, and also spacious at the same time. This is really cute. Yeah, I agree. And then we have like an extended hallway here with a uh, closet built in, really nice. And then an archway into oh look we found the gnome um i am just amazed by this she like merged this crate to sit on with the blankets with this chair that is really cute i feel like you all have so much more space than i do right it's so spacious the bookshelves with that fireplace yeah that is like that is seamless. Look at that. That is freaking seamless. And then we have the um, little gnome hidden back there. So cute. And then here we have the kitchen. I love this kitchen. With the kettle. That's my favorite thing. The little kettle on the, on the stove is so cozy. <gasps> and look at the paintings. Oh, that is so cute. Oh no, the artwork on the fridge, yeah. The blanket and chair merch, yeah, it's ridiculous. It's so cute. Love the open shelving, by the way. That is really pretty. How can people put stuff on the fridge? I have tried. Yeah, so what you're gonna do is you need to delete the walls behind it so it won't snap. Um, and then you can just use the nine key to like raise it up and then you can place it freely basically on the fridge. Um, but you wanna delete the nearby walls, otherwise it will snap to the walls. Um, and then here we have, oh, a little, little office space. Look how cute. It's even like, this is all decked out for Christmas as well. The whole build like feels snowy. What I love is how the exterior and the interior go together so well, like color scheme wise and like vibe wise. It's all very snowy. Or you can use tool. Yeah, you could do that too. You could do that too. Yeah. Uh, this flooring is really pretty. Yeah, the cool tones. I love how it's all cool tones for the most part, but then it still feels like very warm and cozy because it has some like green and red um, accents all over. What is back here? Ooh, a cute bedroom. <gasps> I love the bedding on this. That is so pretty. Uh, all the white looks so good. I try building in white and it looks so bland. This looks amazing. I agree. Yeah. The penguin TV. Ugh. And also a closet in here. Oh, I didn't even see that. I love the hanging clothes over the closet. That is really smart. I really like that. Yep. 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 Okay. Let's go upstairs. Uh, okay. Nice. So we have a little landing over on this side. And then here we have a bathroom. Nice modern shower and everything. Um, 
I'm just amazed when people are able to decorate with all white. I just can't do it. Yeah, I have tried it, but I can't do it. I need something to warm it up. But then this fireplace in the master bedroom is goals. I would love to have that at some point in my life. And then we have like a dresser and then also a closet with a mirror. I'm stealing this. You seeing that? That is so pretty. And then we have a console table and like this little corner is so cozy. Yeah, I mean, I also kind of want to steal this bedroom, please. This is so pretty. What the actual heck? It's like such a, um, sophisticated little house. Everything just flows together so nicely and it's so like soft and powdery and snowy and cute. We have like a little back porch here as well. The roofing is top notch. Love the layout. Yeah, me too. Um, we have a little back door here. So cute with some decorations and then some ski. Wait, this is the front. This is what I was going to check. Yes. This with the, with the barbecue. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, so cute. And then a little bench. And then out here we have a nice fire pit. Um, barely a millennial. Hello, how are you? Thank you for saying hi. I'll try to come back after I get some rest. Of course, AJ, I'm starting to feel really awful. So I, yes, oh my God, my love, take the time you need and I hope you get some rest. And I hope you feel better soon, my love. Um, yeah, this, these chairs, oh, so cute. Love it. Okay, everyone, a round of applause for our dear friend, May. Um, and name your favorite thing. My favorite thing, I think, is the fact is uh, the layout and the color scheme and like how the exterior and the interior go together so nicely and it looks so cozy. I think that might have to be my favorite thing about this. The white flooring, right? But it's all white and feels so warm, right? Yep. The roofing and layout of this one, yeah. I love how you managed to use white so well. Yeah, it's just, we can learn a thing or two from, from May, honestly. The closet with the hanging clothes, I'm stealing that. And also with a mirror on it. Really pretty. Really pretty. Wait, I didn't even, I don't think I read the, um, Hang on. Ah, uh, it's just her, you can find me on Twitch. Okay, which yes, you can, by the way. Go follow Honey May Sims on Twitch, please. Um, we could do a little shout out, actually, for May. Um, and thank you, Barely a Millennial, for the follow as well. I really appreciate that. I really appreciate it. Merry Christmas Eve's Eve. Also, that fence around the lot is adorable. That is so true, actually. The roof looks really cute in the front above the deck. Yes, it does. It does with that little extra. And then sadly, the Christmas decorations for some reason don't translate. I thought they did, but you can see them here on the gallery. Is she Honey Mae Sims? I actually don't remember. Yes, she is. Um, yes. Yeah, okay, you got it, yes. Yeah, so go follow her if you don't already. Follow her on Twitch, she's amazing. Absolutely amazing. Okay, next up we have Gigi! Har Gigi123. Oh, there you are. Oh my goodness. Um, imagine the image is winter on a cold Christmas Eve. The house was silent when all um, of a sudden tons of gnomes invaded and kicked out the humans so that they could know what it's like to be outside in the cold. <laughs> I love that. Um, I might have forgotten some things. Just pretend that they are there anyways. I hope you love it. Oh my God. This is awesome. Um, what is the order? Oh, I think, uh, could any of, any of you, uh, Uncle or Oliver or Minion put the order maybe in the chat? Is that easy for you to do? 
Um, hello everyone, nice to meet you, Rose Diamond! Hi, it is so nice to meet you! How are you? Thank you for chatting, I really appreciate it. Uh... Oh no, gnomes! <laughs> yes! The gnomes strike again, always causing mischief. Just wait until you see them. Okay. 30 by 20. Wait, no, not here. Not here! Yes, that is the order of things today. Uh, let's go here. Thank you for sharing that. I really appreciate it. Here you are. 30 by 20. It's close, by the way. Yes, it is. Yeah, you're literally almost. Yeah, you're one of the last is ones. The best that all are tied up. So true. So true. So true. Yes, Shay, you're up after this one. That's actually very exciting. Very exciting. Mine is today. Yes, I hope um, birthday bingo is uh, fun. Oh my god, that's so cute. Doing well, my birthday is tomorrow and we're going to bingo, so I'm excited. Oh my god, happy early birthday, Rose. Your birthday is actually on Christmas Eve. That's awesome. Happy early birthday. I hope you enjoy it. I hope you have a good day and I hope you enjoy bingo. That's awesome. And thank you for the wiggle. I lost my sim again. Where did I put her last? <laughs> She's a forgotten hollow, right? I left her here. You can come up. We can come with me. I left her in the haunted house. Ignore the blank spot in the back of the lot. Okay, okay, we'll do. We'll do, my love. I'm excited. I'm actually quite relieved that uh, I still don't really feel like I need to pee. Oh. Oh my god, look at all the llamas. That is so cute. Um, wait, did I need to pay my bills? Why are the lights off all of a sudden? Hang on. Let me... Oh, it's a little bit cloudy. That's sad. But that's okay. We can set the lighting. Yeah, that's already a lot better. Wintery vibes. I'm sorry, but this is so cute. I love this. Look at the trees with the little wamas. That is adorable. Oh my god, look at the gnomes. <laughs> I love this. Yes, that's so cute. Llama party. I was almost a Christmas baby and won it out. I can see that. I can see how, cause you know, I thought you were like, no, 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 no. I do not want my birthday on Christmas. Cause then it's like, what are we celebrating? My birthday or Christmas? Whereas when your birthday is on Christmas Eve, you can still really like celebrate your birthday and then the next day it's Christmas. So it's two days of party, basically. Very smart baby, very smart. The roof placement is so nice. I know, look at this. It's so wholesome. It looks like such a cute suburban. I love this part. That is adorable. And I love the back. Oh, so cute. The roofing is so good, my love. That's amazing. Um, They are guards. Oh, so funny. I love the gnomes. I love the gnomes going crazy with these shell. I can, I spy a rainbow Christmas tree and I'm obsessed already. <laughs> what the heck? Okay, so we have this little seating area on the front porch. That is adorable. 
I love this layout and I love all the snow decorations literally all over. That is so cute. <laughs> I love this. I love this so much. Oh my God, that is so cute. Um, My sister's birthday is on Christmas Eve, yeah. I couldn't find the right brick for the for the fireplace. Wait. Well, it looks Oh my god, are you seeing this? <laughs> this is so cool. I think this is my favorite part. <laughs> Oh, the chimney outside, right. Well, this looks really pretty though. I love this. Um, and I freaking love the colored presents underneath the um, rainbow tree. I'm sorry, that is so beautiful. That is the cutest thing. Gnomes in the cat tree. What? <laughs> yeah. Just popping in for a quick hi. <gasps> Simpire, Merry Christmas Eve's Eve. How are you? Thank you so much for saying hi. I really appreciate it. The amount of time to place the snowflake lights. I know, that's insane. I I am obsessed and I love, th these gnomes are ready for movie night. You, you can see their, their little hats popping. <laughs> so cute. I searched Christmas tree and couldn't resist. I can understand that. That's amazing. Um, and then here we have a little cat feeder and a kitchen with a washer. I love that. I love that. That's so cute. And then we have the um, nice separate stove and oven. Oh, I love this. All the shoes too, really cute. You didn't, the litter box is hidden away. Oh, someone's, someone's pooping. Um, hello? Are you okay there, sir? Um, was the toilet too high up for you? Could you not reach that? Is that why you're, uh, using the litter box? <laughs> when you gotta go, you gotta go. <laughs> this is the literal definition of an angry poop. <laughs> Yes, you're so right. Um, <laughs> taking an angry poop, all right. Um, okay, so here we have, oh my God, the gnomes are everywhere. I love this. This makes me smile so big. I love this. Um, gnomes gotta do what a gnome's gotta do. Again, yeah, very true. The use of space in here is so smart with the desk underneath the lofted bed. And then we have the creativity table. <laughs> this creative little gnome took the creative liberty to take off all his clothes, which I I, I can only vouch for that, you know? Um, maybe that's when he feels most creative. Out naked. Wait until upstairs. Okay, I'm excited now. We only had to place one gnome and look at what we all did. I know, I'm never using gnomes again <laughs> as the required object. Mom, come pick me up, I'm scared. Honestly, you should have seen a couple builds before. A haunted Christmas house, you know it can't be good. Um. Oh! Also, Bloxy, hi, how are you? Thank you for saying hi. Oh my Jeebus. <laughs> what the... I can't... Oh my God, this is so funny. Now that is art. <laughs> The flamingo, I know. What is going on, Gigi? I decided to expand that room. Um, and happy I did. Oh my God, that is so funny. That is so funny. I cannot believe it. 
Um, and then for the, we have these two little ones. <laughs> Look at them! <laughs> they're all just in there. Yeah, they're just chilling in there. A gnome is stuck in the toilet? Oh, I can't wait. I can't wait. You literally put them everywhere. They're, they're literally everywhere. Look, there's one getting some work done here as well. Um, he's a, he's a, he's a serious gnome. Stop, does it? <laughs> um, they, yeah, shower party, shower party is right. That is freaking, yeah, okay. So, this one tried to use the toilet, got stuck, and that is when the ghost he was like, Yeah, you know what? I'm using the litter box. Um, I, I'm pretty sure that's what happened. He was like, Yeah, I'm not doing that, I'm using the litter box. Good luck. Uh, too angry. <laughs> yeah. I think you missed the dining room. Oh, that could definitely be true. Let's go and check. Um, but I freaking love this bedroom. It is so, I love the colors. So nice and neutral. And I love this light wood. And this wallpaper color, it is so soft and powdery. And I love it. Uh, it's that one's ghost. Still had to poop as a ghost. That is, that, uh, yeah, I like that. I like that one. Um, oh, I did miss the dining room. Oh my God. <gasps> what is this void? What is going on? <laughs> Better than using a trash can. Just saying true. That is true. And that is how they got in. Oh, okay, so this gate was opened to the gnome underworld. And that is how they got in the house. That makes sense now. It's a portal. Look at all these business gnomes. They're fancy gnomes. They're here for a business meeting. What are they dressed as? They're, I think they're dressed as bears. Um, I'm fairly sure. Um, the upside down, right. That's where they came from, the upside down. And then these look like they're doing a little uh, choreography on the bar. They're getting the party started. They're the party starter gnomes. It's a mouse hole they're coming from. Oh, you sized up a mouse hole? I didn't even know that was possible. That is so smart. This is such a fun, yeah, this is actually amazing. Nine three quarters. <laughs> um. They're planning a takeover of the neighbors' houses. Yeah, th that's what they're doing. Um, they're in a business meeting about how to take over the entire world, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, world domination. And thank you for the wiggle shame. Yep. That is exactly what's happening here. If you size up a mouse hole, does that also size up the mice? I don't think so because the mice are animated. And usually the animations don't size up and down. It's only the objects that do. Same goes, for example, when you size up a fireplace, I'm very, fairly sure, for most fireplaces at least, the fire itself, like the flames don't size, but the fireplace does, um, if that makes sense. Um, good, because that would be terrifying. I would want to see that. That would be awesome. Um, oh my god. Can we please get a massive round of applause for Gigi? This is so stinking cool. I love the entire concept of this. It is so stinking funny. I mean, your favorite part of this, please let us know, but we all know it's the gnomes. Do we have a favorite one though? I think the one on the um, the angry poop one. Wait, no, the Catri ones, I think. I think the Catri ones are my favorite. Or the ones in the bed, because these just make me giggle. I, I love this. The gnomes in the bed, yeah. Everything is epic, yeah. This literally made my day. I, like, my face is hurting from smiling so much. Katri's my favorite, uh, but the bed is so funny, yeah. 
Angry poop gnomes. Yeah, I love those too. The ones in the shower. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The replacement is perfection. Yeah, so true. Gigi, you did a fantastic, fantastic job. Yeah, yeah, this is chef's kiss. 15 out of 10, like, yes. <laughs> yes, this is the joy we need. This is why The Sims is so epic, because you get to do crazy stuff like this. Yep, take that bow, girl, yes. Um, Next up is Shay. That's exciting. Uh Yes, okay, good. Uh mine uh may take forever to place. It has a million uh items placed. Oh, well, that is totally fine. It's going to be fine. When you said include a gnome, I said why not? Yeah, I mean, I mean why only one? Why don't just go wild with it? Why don't just go wild with it? I know. Uh, it's actually, I, I love this. I love that you guys just took the gnome concept and ran with it. It is, it honestly makes me so happy. Um, can we load? Be very nice. You wanted a gnome. I mean, yeah, yeah. Um, there we go. Uh, Noobly, you are, I saw you. I saw you before. Oh, there you are. <gasps> This is a literal gingerbread house. Are you seeing this? I promise I didn't place or take uh, away any of the original walls, even if it may look like it. Oh my God. Yeah. A gingerbread house I made for the shell challenge. Place with move objects. Yes, it's on. We got you covered. A gingerbread house though? What the actual, actual heck? 40 by 30. Uh, yes, we can put it here. That's fine. Uh, I know what my plans are for the day. I'm getting a gingerbread house. Oh, yes, nice. Every, every time I look at like gingerbread houses or gingerbread inspired things, I crave gingerbread so much. Oh, I love it. I don't have any, which is sad, but that's okay. I do have one chocolate chip cookie left. <sighs> There's only one left and I'm leaving it for after dinner, but it's so difficult because I know it's there and I want it now. <laughs> Literally uh, did the outside before stream today. Oh yeah, did you manage to work on it some more? I'm eating gingerbread cookies right now. Oh, I'm so jealous. Oh, I love gingerbread. So freaking tasty. It is taking a while to place. <laughs> You're not wrong. Uh, hi, Wildflower, by the way. Oh my God. I didn't even properly greet you. I totally missed that. How are you? Oh, there we go. Let's get the lady. You're good. Oh, that is good to hear. I hope everyone's doing well. Yeah, I am so I, I freaking love these shell tours. It makes me so happy. I was excited for it all day. Sadly, I can't enjoy gingerbread after the pandemic anymore. Wait, really? That is so stupid. Yours is going to take forever. Yeah, well, that's totally fine. We have gotten the time. So good to dip in coffee too. 
Oh, sorry for yawning. I have never tried that before. That sounds freaking fantastic, actually. Why have I never thought to do that before? Is it because, Nick, you were like, taste or like smell? Did it like change? Um, no, not the rain. Are you kidding me? No, 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 no. We're not doing that. Sunny, please. Oh yeah, it's lagging my game a little bit. Oh my God. Let's wait for the sun to come through. There we go. Uh, much better. Much better. Are you seeing this? What the heck? It's so cool to see how each person did the same shell, yet they're- Yeah, they're so different. I wouldn't even guess that this was all the same. Um... Olive, hey guys, sorry to say, but I have to go. Of course, of course, my love. Um, no, please do what you need to. Uh, I will talk to you on the Discord or later or whatever, but please don't feel bad. Please do what you have to do, my love. Um, yes, this is absolutely insane. The candy cane looking front pat. Oh my god, yes. Yeah, Olive, my love, have an amazing Christmas. Have an amazing Christmas, I love you. Can't eat cinnamon anymore, right, okay. That's so stupid. I have to step away for a second and this is like the cutest thing I've ever seen. I, yeah. What the, is this yarn? That is so creative. What the actual heck? And the snow piles and all these individual yarn to make it look like uh, the icing stuff. So many yarn balls. I have never seen so many yarn balls in my life. Holy heck is right. The patience, I don't have to place all that yarn. I would never be able to place all this. This is, this is insane. Zane. It literally looks like a cookie. This wallpaper is works so well for gingerbread house. Gingerbread house vibes. I should finish my sentences. Um, and all the decorations. I love this door placement. I mean, I'm not going to, but I would love to know exactly how many yarn balls this is. I'm not going to count, but what the heck? I love this so much. This is beyond me. Um, Might be the most creative thing I've seen. Yeah. This is not normal. <laughs> Why so laggy? Um, <laughs> because of the amount of yarn balls, I would guess. Um, my brain just pr processed the yarn balls on the house. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, how many? I want a yarn ball counter. If anyone feels like downloading this and counting them, please let me know. <laughs> but also, How did you manage to get the shape out of the shell? How did you make this tower? How did you do that? Let us know your secret. You did that without breaking the rules, but how? That is a platform tower. Oh my God, yes, I see it now. That is a platform tower. Oh my God, you are genius. <laughs> so will Minion smoke some and Shay smoke times three? <laughs> and neither of you shared. <laughs> you got the good gummies. Yeah, what the heck? And I love this little bow, by the way, that's adorable. Okay, so here we have the front door. Um, this looks cute. Yeah, it really does. Oh 
my God, look at the inside. This is Christmas times a million. The red and green everywhere and these decorations everywhere. Shell challenge, bring out the, the improvised adapt over. Yeah, 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 right. I cannot believe this. I cannot believe you did that with yarn without tool. Yeah, no, that's actually insane. That must have taken you literal ages. Um, can we please take a moment to look at this Christmas tree and admire it? Why are you ruining the vibe by being so tense? Stop it. Um, oh my God, we got him. <gasps> it's also not talk like a pirate, they think you. Look at this. He is sitting on top of the tree and he's so proud. Oh. Um, <laughs> it's me. <laughs> Look at him. I can totally see him sitting there singing that too. He is so proud. I love it. And all the toys and the the bike with the bow on it. It's all in the details, isn't it? That's adorable. And then this little cluttered unit under the staircase. Yeah, is that a size down bike? Really? That is, oh, I love it so much. Yeah, he's a beautiful tree topper. He does make a beautiful tea, tea, tea topper. <laughs> Why can I not talk? He sized it down. So cute. Oh, cookie! It is my last chocolate chip cookie. It is right here. Oh my goodness. I am going to forever put this penguin on the couch in all of my builds, because that is adorable. Oh, look at the custom art. Oh, beautiful. I love it. Oh my God. And then the fireplace and all the decorations. Oh my God. I love this fireplace. That is absolutely adorable. The penguin. Yeah. Isn't it so cute? And then back here we have, oh my God, you even put decorations like bows on the stair railing and the stair railing is green. Chef's kiss, what the heck? And then down here where the lighting is really pretty right now, we have the dining table and it's all decked out and ready for Christmas. That is adorable. Penguin in all of the couches in Solani. Yes, why not? Love it. Forget to credit where I got the art from. Oh, that's okay. That's fine. No big deal. Um, yes, I love these under the windows. I'm so amazed right now. What is, oh, the kitchen is in here. Oh, <gasps> where did you find those? Did you have your Sim make these? That is so cute. Oh, look, and the Christmas dinner is all served and ready to go on the table. No, the wallpaper in here is so cute. Oh, the little tree. Yes, yes. Um. Oh, there's more cookies waiting for me. Thank you. I appreciate it. I'm also going to watch Happy Feet and Honor of the Penguin. That is a really good idea. Oh, I haven't seen, I haven't watched Happy Feet in literal years. Uh, the stove is so cute with the aprons next to it. So nice. Um, and then what do we have on this side? <gasps> Ooh, a little, what is this rug? That is gorgeous. Never seen that before. And then the tree on the, on the little side table. Chef's kiss. That is so smart. More custom artwork. Adorable. I love the touch of yellow in here. That is so unexpected. It works so well. Works really well. And then here, all oh, the postcards with the fairy lights. I'm stealing that idea as well. That's really, really cute. And then through here, a bathroom. Right, right, right. 
even the bathroom is festive. Look at the decorated mirror and the sink. Yes, it's two rugs together. Ooh, so it's, oh, it's a rounded one. And then what is the flowery one? That's beautiful though. I love it. I love this back door placement too. That's adorable. For some reason, I really like that. Um, okay, and then let's go up. The decorated mirror is a fantastic touch. Agreed. Agreed. Um, so up here we have a, some, uh, a little seating area and then a creativity table for the kid. Oh, I love how it has like some cards and stuff on it. That is really pretty. And all these drawings here. Oh, look at this area by the staircase. It has its own Christmas tree. No way. And the snow globes. I'm so impressed by this. This is so cute. And then here is, I take it the master bedroom. Oh, so cozy. Again, with all the decorations and the, um, oh my God, what is this called? What is the word for this? The little llama with the beanie on his head. So cute. Another penguin in the bed. And then here, another Christmas tree, and we have the um, wardrobe situation and tons of shoes. Cross stitches, right, thank you, that's what it is. And then here's a little balcony with some rocking chairs. Oh. It is so cozy. I cannot believe it. And then this bedroom is all blue themed. Each room has its own little Christmas tree, and that makes me so happy. You don't even know. Yeah, every room gets its own tree, Tree, exactly. Oh, I love this room too. And a book on skiing, I'm sorry, but that is just, that detail is incredible. That detail is incredible. There is even a ski like little painting. Did you merge a poster with a frame? Stealing that. I'm 100% stealing that. And then we have some toys and I love how you made a little wardrobe thingy in this nook. Mind blown, exactly. I would move in so fast, it's not even funny. <laughs> Me too. And then, oh, the desk is so dreamy. With the tree and everything. I can't believe it. Oh, so sorry. Um, it's one of the tiny living frames, right? That makes sense, yeah. And then here we have a bathroom with a shower tub combo. Also probably, yep, decorated mirror. The prettiest thing, I cannot believe it. That is so beautiful, so beautiful. Um, yeah, what the heck? Can we please get a round of applause, first of all, for all this yarn placement? Oh my god. And your favorite thing. Name your favorite thing. What is my favorite thing? I don't even know. The fact that each room has its own tree. I love the tree topper. The gnome as the tree topper. And I mean the yarn. Eep, what the heck. The candy cane sticks in the front, yes. Yes, without tool, mind you. That is impressive. Like what? Um, I love the exterior. It looks just like a gingerbread house. Yeah. I love the outside. I love that it looks like a gingerbread. Yeah. I think I like the tree display area platform beside the stairs. Right, that was also so beautiful. And just all the decorations all together. Insane. Insane. Yep, you did amazing. What the actual heck? Can't believe it, mind blown. What the heck, love it. Thank you so much for submitting this, Shay. It's actually insane. Um. Okay, so, sure wouldn't want to follow that. 
<laughs> you're I was gonna say you're up next creepy um the yarn balls is seriously the dedication also hi everyone hi mono how are you it is so good to see you um creepy I am so excited to see what you uh what you created let's go connect it's a little bit annoying that it like disconnects you the whole time um here you go <gasps> Ooh, claus grotto welcome to the claus family home it is centuries old but has been updated over the years it never lost its charm and has been well maintained it may be small um, but this home holds a world's worth of Christmas joy. Outside, there is a lake and reindeer enclosure. Mr. and Mrs. Claus have learned self-care recently. Nice. And don't mind indulging in the hot spring. I love this. Um, I used the giant lot in Mount Kamarabi. Good, because that's where I was thinking of placing it. Because of the snow. I think that's a really good idea. The screenshots already, yeah. Looks gorgeous. Freaking gorgeous. I think after this one, it's time for me to pee. I think the moment is almost there. It's an issue. Because I'm wearing a onesie. Um, thank you for the posture check as well. I need to. Why don't you pee now? Well, because I want to check out the house. <laughs> I can do one more. I can do one more. And thank you for the hydrate. Go now. Okay, fine. <laughs> um, okay, fine. I'll go now. Merry Christmas! Rayo91, thank you. How are you? Merry Christmas to you as well. <laughs> um, this. Oh my god, it's huge. Free real estate on. We can't afford this. There we go. Now we can. We can wait. Yeah, your internet died. Oh no, that's so scary. Is it back now? Let's load into it and then I'll go pee. <laughs> um. Lights keep flickering. <gasps> that is scary. Mine took all her money because of the yarn. Yeah, probably. <laughs> it's like you live in your own shell. Ew, no. Okay, okay, I'm gonna go pee real fast, friends. I think Omanin is right. I should get it done now. Um, I will set you up with the floop slideshow, and then I'll be back as fast as possible, but I am wearing a onesie, <laughs> so there's only so much I can do. Um, okay, I'll be back in a sec, hopefully.
You don't want to stay up? You don't want to... Okay. Bye. So sassy. Why? Why the sass? Very unnecessary, my love. Very unnecessary, but that's okay. Um... Always the drama. Yeah, right. I just gave her treats too, so I thought maybe she would want to stay, but no. Nope, not today. Okay, so here we are. You literally used up the entire lot for this, Creepy. That is actually insane. You, like, used the hot spring thing and you created this entire pond that is frozen over. I cannot believe that. That is insane absolutely insane there's even a picnic bench back here this is a literal winter wonderland and there is a swing set back here as well um look at the roof so smart yeah yeah so you did like the entire like this deck area with a roof over it so pretty it's so pretty yeah the pond is absolutely stunning and then here this must be the reindeer area i love it so smart so cute uh i'm next amazing timing yes you are i'm here i'm here have you guys seen mine yet no not yet joanna welcome my love it's so good to see you today how are you um look at the little hot spring out here and then we have this fire pit underneath this awning. So cozy. Literally everything about this is so cozy. This is why I wish I had the wood reindeer. I'm gonna have to pretend. Oh, I can see that. I love it though. And the pathway leading up to the house is so fancy. Like this house looks so grand. I can't believe it. I love this snowflake on the roof. Oh my God, as a roof decoration, that is pretty. Uh, you can have reindeer now. No, not actual ones, but there is a reindeer decoration that you can like use and like pretend that it's actual reindeer. Also, Curvy Panda, thank you so much for the follow. How are you? I really appreciate it. And look at the giant, giant, giant Christmas tree. That's awesome. Those Christmas ornaments are bigger than my Sim's head. That's insane. That's huge. I love it. The shell looks so different, right? 
Um, you did this without the seasons pack? It's so good. Yeah, oh right, you don't have the seasons pack, huh? It's actually so impressive. Um, yeah, you should definitely add reindeer. Yeah, that would be the cutest thing. You don't even have seasons. So smart to build it here in Mount Kamarebi. That's actually really smart. Um, so when we go in, let's take a look at the entire floor plan. Oh, it is so open. I love it. Oh my god, and the red and green strikes again. I freaking love it. Okay, so let's go in. Um, the homey vibes, right. So here we have the front door and then like this entryway situation with uh, some clutter on the dresser, so cute. And then we have the fireplace here with some chairs. Love these chairs with the flowers on it too. It really goes very well with this entire vibe. That is a good pick and I love the wallpaper too. Um, and then the decoration box is here like underneath the staircase, really, really smart. And then back here, I love how this house like navigates so easy. It's really nice. Um, here we have the Christmas tree. Oh, the train. That is so smart. That is so cute. The train and then all the presents and then the tree placement by this bay window is adorable. You put toys on top of the presents and a bow on top of the dollhouse. Oh my God. Oh, that is so cute. The train is such a good touch, yeah. And then here, I love the red and green mismatched, mismatched uh, dining chairs. That is adorable. Oh, dog food, cute. Little dog food bags. And the clutter on here. I love that you merged these two china cabinets together. That looks really good. Looks really good. And then the kitchen in this in this corner. Yes, please. And it like wraps around. I love that you guys create kitchens that like wrap around this way. I never do that, but it looks so good. I need to shower, but I'm gonna bring my phone to watch a mobile, of course. Be careful though. I love seeing all these builds too much. I know it's, I am obsessed. I love this. I'm back for my date. Lily, how did it go? What the heck? You can't just come in and casually say that. How was it? Um, so here we have this, I love the uh, island part with these stools and the fruitcake. You can't go wrong with fruitcake and the little doggy bowl and the shoes and the trash can. Oh, out here we have like a fire or like a grill situation. I love this outdoor area with the table and these chairs. This is a really good swatch. The red, really pretty. Really pretty. Uh, what am I supposed to say? Good, no red flags yet. Well, that's good. Was he nice to you? Was it, was it like cozy? Um, and there's a heater out here too. Yeah, yeah, I, I really like that. And a woodworking bench too. Um, what is in here? A, uh, a bathroom. Oh, I love the wallpaper in the bathroom. And the little wall light by the toilet. Oh, that is such a cute touch. Uh, hi, Simri. Hope you're having a good day. Hi, Kaylin Rose. How are you? It is so nice to see you. We're doing shell tours and it's so fun. It is so fun to watch all these amazing builds. It feels so spacious, right? He is a rugby player, which is always a good thing. Um, oh, you're getting ads. Oh, no. Oh, sorry for yawning so much. It's just... I'm tired these days. Um, you're back, yay! I was just reading your messages on how he's a rugby player. Cool. <gasps> this cart by the bathtub. Oh, that is adorable. I love that. Never done that before, but I'm stealing that idea from you. Yeah, the cart is honestly the cutest touch. <gasps> Oh, this is so cute. Th this, the, the entire second floor is their, is their 
bedroom. Is this a closet? No way. That is so cute. Look at that. That's a closet. And then there's like shelving units and stuff up there and like hanging clothes. That's adorable. Um, also, Miss Ragegasm, hi, how are you? Uh, thank you for the follow. So here, they have their bed. I love this four poster bed again with this bedding. It's so cute. The bed is awakening something in me. I love this bed. And also, I love this desk. That's so cute. With the map again, the map strikes again. You guys are so smart for placing that. I have to get on a call, but I have been watching. Oh my God, creepy. This build is so freaking good. I know. Look at this. This might be my favorite little area on the house. The little red fireplace area upstairs with the layered rugs. Oh, so cozy. And here we have this uh, little shelving unit or like end table, I should say, with all the knitting stuff. Oh, look at that placement. That is so cute in the bay window. Does that actually slot there or did you place that there manually? Everything is so homey and cozy, right? It's literally so warm and cozy. And there is a balcony up here. It's huge with, um, Loopy? with a, uh, a telescope and a flower pot, little bunny. So cute. Uh, and then the table. Oh, there's skis out here too. I didn't see the gnome yet. Did I miss him? Did I miss the gnome? Is he under the tree perhaps? Uh, you placed it right, right, right. He is by the hot spring. Oh, <gasps> you have got to be kidding me. Oh my God, yes. He is ready. Look at the snow on his nose. That is so cute. <laughs> that is so cute. Oh my God. <laughs> his brother. That is adorable. He's like, this is my hot spring. Yes. He's ready to dive in. Ready. Wait, I didn't close my thing properly. There we go. Um, yeah, that is freaking adorable. I love this keg out here too, by the way. That is really cute. Such a Santa thing to place for like Santa's house for some reason. Um, I'm sorry, creepy. This is amazing. All the snowflakes on the roof. That is such a cute touch. Can we please get an amazing uh, round of applause? Look at the upstairs chimney. Here? Go up a floor. <gasps> oh my God. <laughs> oh no, sir. Uh, <laughs> did you get stuck in there? <laughs> Did you get stuck? Oh no, how did he get in there? What the heck? This is a problem. <laughs> yes, it is. <laughs> oh my God, I love this. I love this. <laughs> I'm the problem, it's me. I think Santa missed the chimney. <laughs> The former Santa got stuck. Yeah, Santa has secrets too, apparently. What the heck? What a creeper. I love that. Okay. Um, that is definitely one of my favorite things because it is so unexpected. And then I what I love, love, love is the toys that you put on top or yeah, the toys on top of the presents. That is a chef's kiss little touch. The train and then the toys on top of the presents. Love, love, love it. Fantastic. Yeah, so amazingly done. If you've got creepy in your name, there has to be something. Yeah, I, that is true. That is correct. Skeleton is officially my favorite. Good. 
Yeah, the train was so cute. And I love the pond too. That is just gorgeous. Love the homey vibes and the open floor plan. Yeah. So cozy. Uh, I 100% agree. So freaking cozy. Um, absolutely amazing. Absolutely amazing. Thank you for sharing this with us. I really appreciate it. The landscaping. Yeah, beautiful. Beautifully done. I want to rent this. Me too. Can we stay? I mean, the skeleton is a bit creepy, but if you don't know that, then totally fine. Totally fine. Um, okay. Joanna is next. Oh, this is nice. Can we all stay there? Yeah, so many places to go for Simmery Con. Um, Joanna, oh my God, this looks so cool. What the heck? On a 30 by 30. This household, uh, this household is starting to decorate for the holidays. And one of those decorations is the, the tree um, that they got from their very own little Christmas tree farm business that is on their property. Uh, no way. Enter through the front gate, pick and cut your own tree and pay a little and pay the little booth on your way out. This home has one primary bedroom and a second bedroom for their teen. Oh my God, I love this. I love this. Um, seems like these Sims are moving in. <laughs> Christmas tree farm, Taylor Swift shout out, right. So cool. So creative and so unique to do that. That's absolutely amazing. Um, yes, okay, please build faster. <coughs> I'm sorry. <coughs> I can't believe how amazing everyone is. Yeah, so talented. I know it's absolutely insane. It truly makes my day. Um, okay, let's just go. This family is already living there, so what the heck. Reminded me of my childhood. We would go pick out our tree from a family that had a farm on their property. Oh my god. It's amazing. That is like such fond memories too. That is so, like, it's something that sticks with you for the rest of your life. They would always give my brother and I an apple when we paid for the tree. Oh my god, really? That is the cutest thing in the world. Um, this also really goes nicely with the fall vibes. Actually, <laughs> it's pretty cool. Um, are you seeing this right now? Look at this property. I cannot believe it. I can't wait to watch Wednesday's stream as well. Somebody shall to explore. Yeah, yeah, it's gonna, you're not, you're gonna have so much fun. Okay, so let's, I mean, what the heck is this landscaping? That by itself already is so beautiful. If we'd been uh, compelled to, we could have had a Christmas tree farm. Aw, uh, we grow pine trees on our property. Um, but now they're far too big, so we'll be selling them to a lumber company. Right, that makes sense. Okay, so chef's kiss for the landscaping. And the roofing is adorable. Oh my god, so beautiful. There is so much to explore also, like back here. And then there is this... Um, wait, did it place backwards? Is this the front door or the back door? No, wait, this is the front door. Yeah, okay, it plays, it plays the right way, okay. Um, this back, uh, 
Um, deck is amazing as well. I hate roofing, so thank you so much. Well, you did an amazing freaking job. I love this. I love everything about this. And there's like a separate little shed here as well. You build on this lot too? Nice. It doesn't even look like the shell, no. The roofing is incredible. Um, okay, so let's go in. So here we have the, oh my goodness, the entryway is already so cute. With a clutter on the thing, um, the side table and the purse. Love the purse and the boxes in the corner. Love it. So here we have uh, like, oh my God, it's so open, but everything kind of like has its own little space. So this is like an extended hallway with, um, with a fireplace, no, a staircase. <laughs> um, and then we have a little bathroom. Oh my God, all the curtains. No way, that is vibes. And the candles on the floor. Yes, please. I would like to take a bath here. Thank you very much. The tucked away bookcase is really smart. That is a really good use of space. Yep, 10 out of 10. So let's go through the kitchen first. Why don't we? Um, Jinx, yes, oh my God. Thank you guys for keeping up with this. Um, I appreciate it. So uh, this kitchen is freaking stunning. Um, hang on, yeah, let's just do it like this. Shelving unit next to the fridge is so smart too. All the clutter is absolutely amazing. This little dining table is so cute with the diagonal wall, the closed off diagonal wall. That's really smart. The clutter is absolutely amazing. And um, look, we have a, a Sir standing here. This living room area is the coziest thing I have seen in my life. Look at the clutter on this coffee table. I'm a fancy sir. That by itself. Fancy, <laughs> fancy sir. Um, the diagonal wall is really, really good, yeah. Every angle is like all the cozy vibes. This is also a, a built that works so well for the fall. I love this accent wall with the wallpaper, by the way. Another good clutterist, Justin. That is correct. Yeah, that is correct. Uh, oh, this little corner. Oh, look, we got him. We got him. He's right there. Keeping watch by the fireplace, just hiding behind the dining table, which I love this dining table, by the way, with the candles and the Christmas tree. They got it up, but they have yet to decorate it. I love that. This was like my 10th layout attempt. I hated everyone before it. Oh yeah. Well, this is effortless, like Shay said. It looks effortless. And um, where did the Sims come from? Um, they already lived on this lot and apparently they had enough money to actually, for me to actually build this. I don't know. <laughs> so we're looking at it with these Sims now. Um. An another clutter area that just blows my mind. I freaking love it. And all the curtains, like the little nooks everywhere. It's just so cute. I want to visit this house in real life really badly. So here we have a landing and then we have a, yeah, the, the actual like master bedroom. Can I have this room please? Cause that is amazing. That is so pretty. They lucked out with this house. Yeah, they're lucky. Oh, <gasps> are you seeing this? Like, I feel like I don't even have to say anything. We just need to like take a little second and look at it. Every little corner is a work of art by itself with all the clutter and everything. That is absolutely amazing. Um. I always enter uh, it is what it is mode when I start doing layouts. Like my brain goes first attempt, only attempt. I get that. I do. I do. Um, yeah, this is absolutely stunning. So oh, flower boxes too, beautiful. And then here we have the extra bedroom, which is so cozy. 
I love the placement of this bed and the color scheme in here. This little corner is adorable. That is so cute with a clutter. And then the nightstand as well. And the dresser, no freaking way. All this clutter must have taken you ages to place all this. Also, uh, it's Mina Lean. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome in, my love. I hope you're having a good day. Uh, perfect place to read a good book. Yes, correct. Um, this bathroom shape is amazing. It makes it feel so cozy with the toilet and the and the shower. And the sink in the little corner and even this clutter in the bathroom. That is goals, my friend. That is freaking goals. I love this. The mirror disappeared. I had a mirror above the teen's dresser. Oh, let me take a look. It might have been. Oh, it's still there. It might have been because I was too close to it when I entered the tap mode. It's still there. Yes, it looks so good. So good. Would never think to do a layout of a bathroom like that. Right. Um, let me restart my Christmas, my Christmas playlist, by the way. You know it's a good stream when you have to <laughs> restart your playlist. Um, Joanna, this is so lovely. I love the lived-in family vibe. Yeah, it's absolutely stunning. It's absolutely stunning. Um... Let's go explore the outside a little bit more. So we have this back porch with a grill um, and the dog toys as well. That is so cute. I always try to make rooms too square and never venture out with shapes. I, you and me both, I feel like I do the same thing. I would never think to do like a, like strange shape for a room, but it works so well. Oh, this is really nice. Very farmhouse cozy. Right. And all these chairs. That is so cute. These different animal chairs. They're all different. And the bicycle parked. You can do some stargazing out here. Again, I'm sorry, but the landscaping is a 10 out of freaking 10. Look at the pathway, too. That is go That is absolutely gorgeous. I'm just now noticing that. That is such a good terrain paint work that you did there. Um, yeah, I want to move in, please. Oh my god, no way! Look at this truck, it's loaded with all the stuff and all the things. That is so pretty. There is something to see in each corner and on every wall, like, it's absolutely amazing. Uh, it is in the gallery, actually. Yes, I can show it to you after the tour in a second. Um, we can put Joanna's uh, gallery idea ID. It's Joanna Jobson. Uh, yeah, the creator. Yes, on the gallery. Um, so you can find it there, actually. This is absolutely stunning. And then this is the part with the... Oh, so this is the little area where you pay? No, this is so cute. You even put the little pencils with the sticky notes and the snacks and the paperwork and everything. How do you think of this? I don't understand, honestly. And then this little thingy as well. How do you think of this? I want to cry. Me too. Um, The penguin in the basket. Yeah, look at him. He's just chilling in the basket. And there is some change back here. That is the perfect clutter item for this. I cannot believe it. The level of detail is beyond me. It's beyond me. 
Um, so here we have a little chill area with a picnic table and a, oh, the pillow on the chair too. And the s'mores. Oh my God. And then the reindeer and all the trees. They disappear when I come too close, but you can see that these have been cut. <gasps> you put the little, the little tree stumps for the ones that have been sold. Oh my God, that is genius. That's awesome. Um, I want to visit here in real life. Yeah. Okay. And all the potted plants also, all the potted plants. That is just gorgeous. Um, I cannot believe this. Okay, everybody, massive, massive round of applause for Joanna. Look at this, this archway alone. This sign? The signs? No, I, I don't... I, please go ahead and take the time out of your day to look at the shell on your own time because... Oh my god. Um... My husband thought of the tree stumps? He who has never played The Sims ever? Well, tell him he's a freaking genius because, oh my God. My favorite was the little area to pay for the tree. Yes, I was gonna say the same thing. If I had to pick a specific area, that would be it. I also love the living room with the um, accent wall. And I love how each corner, every turn, every wall, every, there is something to see and like like an area where you just want to take your time and look at it for a second because there's so much to take in it's so detailed it's absolutely amazing you are so talented um i'm with home minion my favorite is the little stall to pay yeah to rain paint oh good one to rain paint chef's kiss yeah oh yeah yes there are so many favorite parts i know i know Thank you so much for sharing this with us, Joanna, because I would not have wanted to miss this one. Is that a good sentence? I don't know. But this this is absolutely blow, blowing my mind right now. Very homey. Yeah. Thank you so much. I really appreciate you guys. I'm so happy to have people be excited about something I make. Oh my God. Yes. <laughs> Heck yes. I'm excited about this. It's absolutely stunning, my love. Um, I would... Yeah, no, I'm so happy you showed us this because you guys literally make my day with these things. Literally make my day. I won't lie. <laughs> I had a little bit of a mental breakdown this morning because I got up early and started my PC early because I wanted to finish this edit for a um, legacy challenge episode. Um, and I needed Mr. Simri for the final edit, knowing he wouldn't be home tonight, so I needed to get it done in the morning. And then my editing software decided to, like, glitch on, on me and, like, crash on me, which all in all made it so that I couldn't have the edit finished in time for Mr. Simri to do the final edit for me, so it can't be up tonight, it will be up tomorrow, which <laughs> full-on made me cry and panic this morning. <laughs> I'm so dramatic, but I really wanted to have this video up tonight, but alas, it's gonna be tomorrow. Um, so my day was a little bit sucky because of that. And now I'm seeing all these builds and I'm like, my heart is so full. My heart is so full. I love it. Um, and now to be disappointed by my build, trouble you will get banned. I'm warning you now. You think you had a unique layout too? I think you had a unique layout too. I haven't seen anyone turn the shell in that direction. True, true. I saw that too. <laughs> no, never. Um. Okay. Okay. Let's go see Troubles Shell. Um. Oh, and then Justin, you're up next. Are you still here? That's awesome. Uh, yay! You're here. Oh, that is yours. Oh, 
ultra modern. Ooh, I'm intrigued. Um, thank you for the wiggle. While I look for trouble, here you are. Um, <clears throat> Christmas home. This two bedroom, two bath home has a family. Um, and the Christmas. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, I love this. Okay, so we're putting this on. Oh, look at all these decorations and this pathway. Oh, I'm excited. I'm excited. Um, right. I can't remember if I put that in the. You did. You did. You did trouble. Yes. It looks really cute. Um, should we just put it? There's someone in that lot. We'll put it here in the gingerbread one. I was just going to say, Simri, you are doing great time-wise. Yeah, we have four total left, including Justin's. Uh, yeah, so with Troubles included, it's five. We're doing good. We're doing really, really well. It is always so difficult to like time manage these things because honestly, it also depends on how big the shell is. But I just never know. There is no way for me to kind of like... I can't prepare like how much time I'm going to be spending on each tour because honestly, they're all so different and like... Some lots are huge and some are small. Like it's very hard to manage these things, but I think we're doing really well. Thanks to my amazing mods. Uh, so festive just from the picture. Yeah, the tree in the front is awesome. Awesome. Ooh, I love this already. Um, where's my... There you are. I love that you show every detail. It's so much fun. Honestly, I, I live for this. <laughs> I live for this. I want to see every detail. You need to look at it at night. Okay, perfect. Perfect, perfect. Um, me and Mr. Simri, by the way, went to a theme park yesterday here in the Netherlands for all the duchies. Uh, we went to the Efteling and it was so cute. It was all decked out for Christmas and they have like the cutest little vibe with the cutest little builds like houses. And it always makes me, gives me so much uh, inspiration um, like build inspiration. I'm looking for, we didn't really take any photos actually, other than this one. It was us at the theme park, really cute. Um, but yeah, they have so many like cute builds and all these Christmassy vibes and it really gets me in the mood to build. Um, you live close there? Oh yeah? Nice. You need to look at it, oh yeah, at night, let's go. Um, I'm sorry, this is, I'm sorry. What? Uh, I still want to go to the uh, Winter Efteling, but the tickets are so expensive. Yeah, Mr. Simri actually still got it for my birthday. So that was my, my birthday present. Really, really nice. You put all the slippers or like the, it's not slippers in English, it's flip flops. <laughs> Oh my god, I am so imp impressed by this. And then there's more lights, different ones up top. Oh my god, flip-flop tree. Oh, what did you say? You misspelled it? <laughs> oh no, you're fine. Um, this is absolutely amazing. Also, thank you, Lee, for the YouTube sub. That is so kind. Streamlabs didn't like that, yeah. I didn't see it, I was too late. Um, Are you leaving? Are you leaving, Rainbow? Uh, you gotta go have dinner with your parents. Yes, of course, have a lovely dinner, my love. Thank you for hanging out with us. I really appreciate that. 
Thank you for all the support and have an amazing freaking Christmas if I don't talk to you anymore before that. Um, love you. Bye. Um, okay. Look at this. That is so cool. My Sim is kind of dressed for it too. That's awesome. She fits in. <gasps> you sized up the blocks. Yep. 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 This is so festive. Yeah. I love everything about this. And then here, oh my God, all the Christmas lights, all the Christmas lights all over the place. Are you seeing that? I love the roofing, by the way. I love it. Um, oh my God, that is gorgeous. I love the colored lights too. Such a vibe. I freaking, yes, that's nice. Okay, so let's go in. Oh, <gasps> no way. Nicely decorated. I love it. Oh, the mailbox. <laughs> oh, the mailbox. Let's just pop it here. The pathway is freaking goals. That's so cool. That is so cool. Um, okay, so when you walk in the front, I love the placement of the staircase. That's awesome. Uh, I think I've learned that I need to do rounded lights more. Right. I have been lurking with you on the big TV while I baked Christmas, cr baked a Christmas you log. That is so cool. How did it turn out? And also, hi, it is amazing to see you. That sounds delicious. It does. Can I have? Did you did you make enough for the whole class? Cause uh, <laughs> I would like some. Thank you. This kitchen is so cool. I love the shape of this. Are you seeing that? With all the clutter, the tiles are so cool. I love the blue in here. It really goes nicely with the Christmas vibes. Cluttered little corner, cluttered fridge. Gotta love that. The streamers between the banisters. Oh, yes. Oh, that is so cool. Oh, yes. So we have a dining table here with some um, napkins and some candles. Oh, baby Yoda, hi. Oh my God, I haven't seen him yet. That's awesome. And then all the presents already. What are these? What is that? That is so cute. Blue and white is a traditional. Oh, really? I did not know that. Kind of went with it. Nice. That's awesome. Uh, love the blue kitchens uh, always. Oh, yeah, that's awesome. I love it, too. I love this uh, living room. So festive. The little decoration and the TV. Yes. And then we have a chess table back here. Oh, this is a cozy little area. I like this a lot, actually. A lot. Um, ooh, this shower is cool. Oh, I really like what you did here. That is smart with the uh, room dividers. Really smart placement of that. And the plunger. Chef's kiss. I love it. I love it. Um... And then, oh my goodness, a coffee corner. <gasps> oh, that's so cool. No way. That is so cool. This coffee corner, I think it's gonna be my favorite part. That is truly amazing. And then we have another bathroom in here as well. I love this one. My cl This is my classic go-to bathroom layout. It always works. It always looks cute. Um, coffee nook sold. Yes. When can I move in, please? And thank you. Uh, so upstairs, we have this little landing situation. And then in here, we have a tiny little office space. Ooh, I love it. That is really cute. I need that in my life. Yeah, I know. Me too. Love all the clutter on the desk. That is amazing. I love the colors in here too. 
And then, oh, this is super colorful. I love that. You went all out with colors in here. That is amazing. And then we have a dresser with tons of stuff on it. Ooh, this, um, this painting really suits it nicely too. This is cool. The laundry. That is really cool. I did not see that coming. I really like that. The little laundry nook. Oh, a little shared kids room for a toddler and a kid. Ooh, they're a streamer. So much clutter on the desk. Where's that rug from? Uh, this one. Let's find out. Bowling stuff. I did not know that. That is really cool. Trouble, the placement of the Christmas lights outside. Yeah, it's gorgeous. I love this uh, wallpaper. I haven't used that in so long. It's really cute. Um, Never saw that swatch ever. Yeah. Ah, oh, Batu, where? <laughs> Where where is Batu? Ah, oh, Batu. Um, out here we have a little balcony with a bench and a telescope. All the lights, I can't get over that. That is amazing. That is amazing. Batu is everywhere. Yeah, I did see some like clutter and stuff from Batu up there. That's amazing. I love the Batu stuff. I always steer away from it because I know that many people. Uh, not many people have it, but I love it. So look at this house from the back in the dark with all these colorful lights. And this tree. So we ha also have like a little barbecuer out there and then a um, picnic bench and a pool that you probably don't want to swim in in the winter time. I'm still in awe over the giant tree with the lights. Yeah, the streamers uh, on the streamers desk. Oh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, but two. That's nice. I love it. And the posters. That's really cute. Oh, my God. Um, my favorite part about this house. A huge round of applause for trouble, everyone. My favorite part about this house. The coffee bar. But also the tree with the flip flop, the flip flop tree. And also this and also the OK, <laughs> I can't pick. <laughs> I love everything, but I think my favorite, 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 favorite would be the coffee nook. Yeah. Yeah. Loved all the blue and white. Right. Yes. I love that too. And welcome back from the Lurk Almond. Love the decorations outside. My favorite is the giant tree. Yeah. I didn't find, uh, you didn't find the gnome. Oh my God. Yes. Thank you for reminding me. Um, can you point me in the right direction? Is he in the tree? First floor by the tree. Um, round floor by the tree? Look closely at the train. No way. <gasps> you have got to be kidding me. Oh, hello. <laughs> that is awesome. Oh my God, that is awesome. No freaking way. That is so cute. Oh my God. That is brilliant. You are brilliant. He looks so happy. Yeah, he is so happy, like riding the train around the tree. Best known placement award. Yeah, I feel you. That is so stinking cute. That's my favorite part. It has to be. It has to be. Um, yes, amazing. Huge freaking round of applause for Trouble. 
so cool. You guys, I can't get over how creative you are. That's amazing. Clap, clap, clap is right. Um, then up next is Justin. Starting, I am starting to get a little tired, guys. Oof. Uh, all these impressions. Oh my God. Um, okay, please work. Thank you. There you are. Ooh, this is something entirely different. Um, a freaking tree blocking the view. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> Why? Uh, an ultra modern rental with big windows decorated for Christmas and Granite Falls. Feel free to re-landscape. <gasps> Ooh, my first, one of my first builds, so please don't hurt me. I would never. I would never. I think I'm just going to place it here so I'm for sure that there is no um, snow blocking it. Um, Emily, thank you for the follow. Welcome in, my friend. How are you today? Modern. We haven't seen any of those. Try it at night. It looks cuter. Okay. First built. Yeah, one of your first builds. Can we talk about that for a second? That's so cool. I feel honored that you did my shell. Um, you can look at landscaping first because not much to see. Okay. Furnished. Yes, let's go. I don't think of modern builds when thinking festive, but like people decorate modern builds for Christmas in real life. Right, yeah, people live in modern houses and celebrate Christmas. So, but yeah, it's funny how your mind just doesn't go there, like immediately right off the bat. My first build was a large rectangle with a roof. I, yeah, mine too. <laughs> mine too, definitely. <gasps> no way. Okay. Let's look at it at night. Oh my God, look at the lighting. I love that with these trees outside. No, this is really cool. I love this. I'm bad at landscaping, so I feel you. Uh, my build's only uh, the second Sims 4 build I have ever done. Really? Did you used to build in other Sims games though? I consider myself a Sims 3 build master, but Sims 4 is a whole new ball game. Ooh, that's so interesting. Um, this is awesome, Justin. I love the flooring that you use for like the, the, the um, roofing. That's really cool. Um, and then when we go around, we have a nice, ooh, the fountain is so fancy. I love it. And the lit up trees are beautiful. And we have a little lounge area here. Oh, that's so cute. And this grill area with a sink and the fire pit. Yes, please. Yes, please. That's awesome. Um, I love the trees out front. Yes, I'm with you. That is so festive. I love it. I love mixing the chair and the lounger. It looks so nice and I never uh, do that. I have never thought to do that, but it's so nice. I love the decorations by the front door and the little nut. Well, it's actually a huge nutcracker <laughs> greeting you. Oh my God. Okay. And the snowman on the roof. I think this is going to be high up there with my favorite things. I can tell you that already. A little snowman on the roof. Are you kidding me? Oh, oh, this is pretty. The color scheme is really pretty. Yeah, that's adorable. So we have this entryway. I love this uh, huge window on the side. That's really cool. And the soft pink in the tiles for some reason works really well with this flooring. I don't know why, but it just, it really, it's really satisfying to me. Uh, Sarah, hello, how are you, my love? 
I love the white Christmas, uh, the Christmas tree. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the snowy white and gold one, it goes so nicely with the color scheme in here. Um, so we have this massive island that I love. You placed a dishwasher in there. That's really smart placement. Tuck away that dishwasher. Really cool kitchen island. And then a huge dining table that is ready for a family dinner. The glasses in pink, ooh, they match the fruit bowl. That a level of detail is actually really cool. Uh, good, I hope you're doing well. Merry Christmas. Yes, Merry Christmas to you as well. Thank you so much. The white Christmas tree with the uh, decorations, it just matches so nicely. Hello? <laughs> Hi. Um, are you guys just chilling? Just chilling. Don't mind me. It's, it's modern, but yet so soft looking. Yes, exactly. I love this fireplace. I never use this anymore, but it is really pretty. And then here we have a, uh, I love the yellow. It's so like refreshing. So we have a nice seating area with a couch here and a television and a nice uh, shoe closet. I love that. Yeah, nice like three, three, three gnomes chilling next to each other by the fireplace. It's great. Um, and then we have a ladder taking us upstairs. Ooh, another fireplace. <gasps> Ooh, I love this. The bed by the big window. That's gorgeous. Really cute. And the decoration on the window too. And then we have a bookcase here and a desk setup situation with all the clutter. <gasps> yes, I love it. And then... Are you seeing this bathroom? That is so chic. With the colors, with the gold touches. I love that bed. Yeah, that bed is, is so pretty. Um, With the curtains and like the gold touches, it's such a fancy bathroom. I love it. It goes like around the corner. I like how the tub is in its own little section by the, like by the window. So you can just chill in your own in your tub and like still be somewhat closed off from the rest of the bathroom. That is really nice. This makes me want to build another modern home. I love modern builds. I get that. I haven't built anything modern in the longest time, but now I'm like itching to. Um, this is really pretty, Justin. I love the use of this window too on this bump out. That's really nice. It gives it like an extra level almost and up here as well yeah it's it's just really gorgeous and these stacked ones too yeah you did an amazing job i never can use that window i find it so hard to use as well really difficult um but you did amazing so a huge round of applause for justin everyone please and my favorite thing has to be, I think, the snowman on the roof. And I also love the yellow, the pops of yellow throughout the whole build for some reason. It just makes everything like flow together. And it's so unexpected. It makes it so like fresh, but still very festive. I love it. And the gnomes, the like three gnomes in a row. Um, so nice. Love the way the outside of the house looks. Yeah, I love the like the exterior with the brick and then the wood on top. It's gorgeous. The outside lounger and chair because it's just something unique that not a lot of people do. Agreed. Agreed. The kitchen. Love me a good island. Oh, yeah. Yes. Kitchen islands are the best. I agree. You outdid yourself. This is really freaking stunning. Thank you for sharing it with us. That was so cool. Modern is so like refreshing. Um. So next up we have Enamora. Are you still here, my love? Uh, okay. Yeah, so we're down to the last three actually. I can't believe it. You are nice. And also just 
Uh, just Michaela, thank you so much for the follow. Thank you, thank you. Um, I think you're all the way down here somewhere. Huh, not anymore. Okay. Um... I saw you earlier. That is so weird. Uh, um, oh God. What is it? Uh, do you see it in here anywhere? These builds are freaking stunning, by the way. I know it's in there. Yeah, I saw it too. Me and my freshly shaved legs are now back at the computer. Yay! Um, wait. Oh, here it is. Is this it? Holiday farmhouse. Right. We got it. We got it, friends. Oh my god, this already looks freaking stunning. I can't. No, wrong. Wrong. Um. I want to place it somewhere, but everything is taken. <laughs> Wait, can we like... I think they can... I think they... I think it's still placing, so that's good. Um, Jacku, hi, how are you? You have me at farmhouse, yeah, yeah. Um. All ah, right. I think. Yeah, it's, I placed it there, too. Let's go. It looks stunning already. I'm amazed already. Uh, thank you, Kay Diddle, for the follow. How are you? Thank you so much. This family is living the best life, getting all the cozy homes. Yeah, they're moving like three times a day. They're not even moving, they're just getting a new house. Um, Eve, thank you so much for the... No, no. <laughs> no, no. No, no, it didn't place. Um... What if I just... What are you doing? Is my game breaking on me? <laughs> this is not a good time. Oh boy. Oh, here it comes. What? That was weird. Um. Oh, it's doing something. Too much stuff in the file. <gasps> no, there's no chance in heck. No. There is no chance in heck. No wonder it took a bit. Yeah. <laughs> um, I'm done with the heck. Yeah, I'm done. I, I, I'm so done. Um, I quit building after this again. I'm never doing it again. So there is that. Um, you also did a speed build for this, by the way. So uh, everyone, you can look, go look that up if you're interested. So where the heck do we begin? I love the landscaping. This pond is insane. Yeah. Uh, I had decorations, yeah. Sadly, they don't translate. I don't know why. 
This landscaping is insane. Once again, with a pathway, that's gorgeous. And then we have another pathway all the way around, all the way around. And we have a little fire pit as well. And then this sand pit is goals. We have like a tent. Oh, I love how you place the tent so they can sit there like covered and then watch the movie. That's really smart. With a swing set and everything. Oh my God. Also, I need you to explain how to landscape because what the heck, yeah. That is so gorgeous. And then here we have this, yeah, this pond with a fence. And um, this, the well, I'm, my brain is like done. <laughs> the well, the fence placed around it. Oh my goodness, yes. Okay, and then we have the house itself, by the way. The roofing is stunning. I love this glass insert as well. There is so much detail, I absolutely love this. Yeah, same. The glass roof is goals. That is beautiful. Um, the roofing in itself and like the placement of the windows, I freaking love it. I had to create some uh, more light in the room beneath it. So I thought glass roof, very smart, very smart. So we have a front porch first off over here that is fully decorated. We have like a table and we have a seating area and a tucked away, uh, a tucked away little um, fireplace. That's amazing. That is absolutely stunning. And then when we go in, we have this. Ooh, I love the flooring in here. This entryway with the hanging clothes and everything and all the decorations. Those benches have to be some of my favorites to use. Yeah, they're really cute. And then, okay, so when we look at the floor plan, that is gorgeous. That's so like open. The, the living room with the yellow couch, again with a pop of yellow and all the decorations, like, what the heck? Just, just sit here for a minute and like, just take that in. Cause there is no way I can like, look at all the clutter. Like that is just too gorgeous. Look at everything like under this table by itself already. That's stunning. I need to go back to the drawing board. Honestly, me too. I live for open floor plans. I can tell because you knock it out of the park. That is the way you did it. It's just so beautiful. And then all these paintings. It's so full of stuff like it is, but like in the best way, it looks like a very old lived in house that has just all the stuff in it. I love how you use these lights on here. It looks like uh, little handles on the cupboard. Looks like it's from a Christmas movie. Exactly. I don't know if I can self plug in here, but if you look up. Yeah, yeah, I was just going to say you can't place links in here, but yes, look her up uh, on YouTube, everyone, and you can see the speed build for it. I have been wanting to watch it, but I wasn't allowed to <laughs> until I've toured it so I can do it tonight. Um, one of those classic Hallmark Christmas movies where the woman from the city leaves her big job for a man in flannel. Yes. Can I please play that woman? And can we please have Mr. Simri play the man in flannel? <laughs> that would be so cool. Oh my God. Um, yeah. So. I think you, if you just try to post the link, you can't do that. But maybe one of my mods can look up this, the video. Um, and then they can post the link maybe. Also just a piece of cereal. I love your username. Thank you so much for the follow. I really appreciate it. Um, oh, you have an app playing. That's fine. Uh, okay, so look at this kitchen also. This is absolutely beautiful. You're back. Yay. Welcome back. Yeah, that kitchen, right? 
It's gorgeous. Just take all in, take, take in all that clutter. I cannot speak for the life of me. I love the placement of the staircase too. And all the presents underneath the tree. That is insane. That is insane. Also, um, could you just maybe like point me in the direction of the, of the gnome if I miss it? Because I am 100% going to miss it, I think. Um, hi, AJ, how are the builds going? We're going strong. We're going strong. After this one, we have two more to go and then that's it. The island shape is really unique. Yeah, I love that. I think it's posted in self promo in Discord. Ooh, well, everyone, just go check there then. If you miss it, I will. Okay, perfect. Perfect. Um, so we have a little... Um, ooh, I love the placement of the rug in here in the bathroom. That is really smart. And the plunger. I really need to think of that plunger more often. I really need to place that more often. Um, what else do we have? Okay, so let's go up. Oh, cute landing. Cute. With a desk situation. Loving all the clutter up here. Ooh, it's really narrow. I love that. That really suits this house. So we have this bedroom. Thank you for the wiggle. And thank you for the hydrate, AJ. Um, yeah, this layout is so nice. I know. Look at the colors. Ooh, I love this little dude. That's so cute. I love the shelf as a nightstand as well. And then here we have a, uh, a computer desk with a streamer setup. That would be the coziest setup actually with this stuff behind you. That's, that's really cute. I struggled with the upstairs so much. Oh yeah. Well, it turned out beautifully. So here we have the master bedroom. Ooh, I love this painting in here. That's a vibe. Yeah, that's gorgeous. And I love these little windows up here too. Yeah, beautiful. Um, oh, I love the clutter here too in this little corner, all the plants. Sort of like boho, but also very festive. And I love the mirror. Oh, this is my favorite mirror in the game. I freaking love that. Couldn't figure out the layout. No, well, but you nailed it though. So you got there in the end. I think that might be my favorite bed. Yeah, it's my new favorite one, I think as well. And then here we have a nice bathroom. I love the colorful shower curtain that really just goes so nicely with this house. Really, really cute. This is absolutely stunning. Let's go to the deck downstairs. Also, thank you, Cozy Gamer 8, for the follow. Welcome in, my friend. How are you? Let's go down to the deck. Um, I'm obsessed. Look. Is that burgers or cookies? It's burgers. Oh, I'm so hungry. Oh my goodness. That is so pretty. All the, I love the festive fireplace outside. That is so creative. Can I rent this place out for the holidays? Yes, please. I only just noticed what you did with the deck. That is so pretty with the fencing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Those burgers weren't supposed to be there. Well, they fit the vibe. <laughs> I really like them. <laughs> Look at the little plant corner back here too. So cozy. Um, I, I always love this. How, what would you call this? I never know what to call this, like a makeshift pergola type thing. And then, um, ooh, we have a nice, a nice bar out here. Oh, that is fancy. I love it. Gorgeous. Oh my God. Yeah, and then we're back outside here by the planters and the fire pit. I could walk around here for literal ages. Look at us go. Ooh. Oh my God. Okay. I think I missed the gnome. <laughs> Or did you use the, did you use the sandy gnome? 
Is, was it the one in the bedroom? Um, back of the house. Upstairs? Downstairs? Oh my god, I found him! <laughs> oh my god, that's awesome! <laughs> yes, thank you. That's great. He gets his own little platform. Oh my god, that is so cute. That's that's my favorite part. <laughs> I didn't know what to do with that little square. Well, uh, you you found purpose. <laughs> I don't even know where to begin by naming my favorite part. You are so insanely talented. It's actually making me a little bit upset. Um, what the heck? I mean, obviously the landscaping and I love this island with the well. That is just makes me a little bit upset as well. That is just so cool. And then I love the placement of the clutter. For example, like this little corner with the little plant and then you can see through this archway and it's just Screenshot heaven. Screenshot heaven, this house. Honestly. Uh, excuse me, have you seen your builds? I mean, no. To heck with my builds. This is so cool. <laughs> this is so freaking fantastic. My favorite is definitely the way the outdoor is landscaped and decorated. Absolutely stunning. I, I can see that. Um... <laughs> no, there you go. I got it for you. <laughs> um, great views. Yeah, the, the gnome is lucky up there. Uh, please don't make me pick a favorite thing. <laughs> it's all so cool. So many eclectic touches. That's the word I was looking for. Uh, that shouldn't work together, but they absolutely do. Right. That's exactly what you were wording it so much better than me. The eclecticness of this house, if that makes sense. Uh, I saw my favorite part is the overall vibes. Yes, I just want to be there in that home. Yes, that is totally something you can you can say. Yes, please. Um, also, the swatch of this chair with this table and rug. It sparks joy in me. I don't know why, but it's just so pretty. And I love the shape of the island also. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So those are all my one favorite things. I'm sorry, you can't make me choose. That is just not a thing and that's possible. Um, I think this is the first house I've used the brown wallpaper. Oh yeah, it's awesome. It looks really good. The outside landscaping just brings this to a whole new level, right? Yeah, no, I agree with that. The rounded islands are normally uh, empty as well on the bottom. Um, oh, really? Did you place clutter in them? Is there not clutter in them? You did that yourself? Oh yeah, I see it now. You sized this down. Well, you made that look seamless. I thought it was I thought it was built in with the decoration boxes in there. You can't do this to me. Like this is absolutely stunning. This is why I need to get better at landscaping. It really transforms the build. It does though. It makes all the difference. Yeah. Thank you so much for sharing this. I know what I'm doing when I, while eating dinner later. I'm watching the speed build for it. Um, absolutely, absolutely amazing. Thank you so much for sharing this with us, my love. I cannot believe it. I cannot believe it. Um, okay, so up next, we have hybrid a uh, heroin. Even though it took me forever, I did have fun building it. That makes me so happy. That is all I want, you know, with these builds. Um, editing the vid was something different. Oh yeah. Was that a lot of work? I can see that. You set the build it I have to be Christmassy to, uh, so some gremlin part of my brain went, I gotta do the wrong holiday. I freaking love that. I love that. I 
I did see you down here. Yeah, I saw you down here. Oh my God, I love this. My second ever completed build. I do not buy that for a second because this looks already amazing. Um, and shall challenge a dark, stuffy home perfect for the family whose entire life revolves around waiting for next Halloween to revive with wholehearted dedication at much uh, preemptive planning of next year's big Halloween bash. That's so creative. I did Sims 3 ones, like I said. Well, yeah, but still. Um... I've never built in The Sims 4, just watched a lot of builders, right. Uh, so this is on a 30 by 20. I kind of like uh, the vibes here. Ah, uh, it doesn't fit anywhere though. Let's go, let's go here. I'm excited. Uh, thank you for the hydrate. I need that. I'm almost out of water. I'm so looking forward to this. Me too. Hey, Floopy. Hi. Are you looking for food? Your food will be here in 10 minutes, my love. 10 minutes. Is it raining outside? You're all wet. You're all wet. Okay. Yes. When will there be a bathroom themed holiday? Oh my God, that would be hilarious. I already love the lights on the outside. Yeah, me too. My first idea was to not do Christmas, but I wanted to do a new holiday in every room. Yeah, I remember you talking about that. Then I panicked about which holiday would be in a bathroom and felt uh, bad, so I gave up. And oh my God, that's why the, when will there be a bathroom themed holiday? Yeah, that's all. Oh my god. There's no chance in hell. This is awesome. This tree alone. Hi, Floop. Hi, my love. Are you um, going to be in the way? That's nice. I hate doing bathrooms. Yeah, sometimes I love them, but usually I hate them. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. Are you going to sit in the way? That's nice. Did you want to sit on my lap? Or are you just going to stare into space? Um, and she's out. Okay. Okay, so the level of detail on this already is insane. And they are ready to party back here. Are you seeing this? Are you seeing this? Is that a fountain back there? Oh my God, that's awesome. Look at it go. That's so cool. I feel like I am weird. I love doing bathrooms. Yeah, it depends. Like sometimes I love it, but sometimes when they're like too big or I don't know what to do with the shape, then I can really dread them. Um, Look at this freaking bar back here. That is so cool. They are ready for the next Halloween. Oh my God. Yes. Could you like not disappear on me? Thank you. Look at him. Look at him chilling. Hi, buddy. The monster mash on the, uh, on repeat. Just picture them blasting spooky Halloween music late into, uh, late, yeah, of the night, exactly. For only your second build, this is amazing. Yeah. This is absolutely great. Um, oh my god, I love these picnic tables back here too. All these lanterns. This is adorable. And the roofing 
On this, again, I love this part. The little awning over the back door and everything. This is really cute. This balcony, the decorations, like the little spooky lanterns or like lights up there. I remembered my landscaping being worse. Your landscaping is fantastic. Are you kidding me? Look at this crazy, creepy dude out here too. I love this front deck. That is really cool. It kind of wraps around this little corner. I love the use of different wallpapers. That is really well done. Um, the fencing with all the lanterns is great. I love how the lanterns literally go all the way around the house. That is absolutely stunning. And I love the roofing. Oh, so creative. Um, okay, so when we go inside, oh my God, this is all Halloween. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? That is so cool. So we have this little entryway here with a grandfather clock and everything. And uh, this little table with all the decorations on it. Oh, I love it. I love the placement of the staircase in the middle of the room. It really divides the space. That's really well done. Very smart. So back here we have the living room area. Ooh, I have never seen this before. That is really cool. This is honestly so funny because I was looking at everyone else's bills like, oh, mine are so much less detailed and then there really is stuff everywhere. Yeah, no, this is really good. I'm glad you're realizing that. Ooh, oh my God. <laughs> there we go again with the spiders. <laughs> they always get me, why? I like the idea of just section of the entry with the stairs. Yeah, it's really cool. And I've never used this couch in my life, but that's awesome. Um, and then here we have the dining table. Oh, so cozy still also. All the fall vibes in here are incredible. Um, so we have the kitchen here, very nicely done, very detailed. Cookies on top of the fridge, love it. You gotta love it. You gotta hide it from the kids so that they can't reach. Um, <laughs> oh my God, that clip. <laughs> That's great. The tile um, in the kitchen, yeah, on the wall. That is really pretty. I think the only layout change I made was swapping the kitchen and then uh, and the dining room and I was definitely, yeah, yeah, that was really smart. That was a smart move on your part because I like it tucked away in that corner a lot. So here is like a little desk situation. Ooh, I love it. That is so cute. Like tucked away with an archway. All the colors in here are so pretty. That's gorgeous. What is back here? So this is like a little bathroom, I think. Yeah, like a little half bath. So fancy. I love the red. Um, and then we have ooh, the spiders again. <laughs> I forgot that they were there for a second. And then we have a shared bedroom here. Oh, I love the clutter on the side table. That is adorable. And the spooky wallpaper with the ghosties. Oh, adorable. And the uh, two seater like desk situation is really smart as well. This is really cute. Really cute. Um, so then we go up. Why does everyone else have more rooms on the inside than I did? Well, yeah, I mean, everyone is so unique with their layouts. It's so impressive. So here we have, uh, I love this. I love this nook. This might be one of my favorite parts of this house is this nook with this chair and this table. That's really cute. And we have a nice uh, end table here with some clutter on it. And then here we have that gorgeous balcony. I love this. That's really cute. And then a full bathroom out here. 
Ooh, yes. Love this. I love the tile on the floor. That's so pretty. I never use this. Um, I use that lamp so many times. That lamp is my best friend. I love this lamp. I, I love this one too. I only recently learned to love that one and I really like it. Um, ooh, this bedroom. That is so spooky. I love it. This is all the right vibes for this house. That makes so much sense. It's all vampire-y. It also is really like Bella Gothy with a chess table and everything. It's, I love this. Someone told me my first build looked gothic and so I just took it and ran with it and went crazy with a fancy gothic house for my next one. Nice. Yeah, this is really pretty. I love this bedroom. That's gorgeous. Um, I can't get over this roofing and the use of wallpaper. I think that is one of my favorite aspects of this build. And then this balcony, I am obsessed with this little balcony situation. Um, with the fence and the window down here and then the lights up here. I think that's my favorite part is this like area of the house. That is so incredibly well done. Can we please get a huge round of applause? Can we also take a look at these nice gravestones back here? That's amazing. And the trick or treat candy. Um, absolutely beautiful. You did amazing. Yeah, this is my favorite part. What is everyone else's? I think, yeah, this has to be it, the balcony situation. And the placement of the gnome is freaking fantastic as well in the tree. That is gorgeous. The kitchen, yes. Favorite part is the landing at the top of the stairs. I love that one, I love that one. You went totally different route with the assignment. Yeah, aside from that alone, that you like, you just went for a completely different holiday and I freaking love it. That is, yeah, that's just really different and really cool. Thank you for sharing this with us. And the fact that you're not very experienced with Sims 4 builds, you are freaking talented, my friend. Um, Your favorite part was the full Halloween vibes? Yeah, I get that. I honestly just love the whole exterior, the housings, uh, mix of stone and siding is very well done. And I love the outdoor huge bar. Yeah, such a good part of it too. So good. I just enter a vague state and become super detail oriented. I, I see that. It is very detail oriented. Okay. If you had not said it, uh, we would have never, yeah, we would have never known. Yeah, no, that is so true. Um, okay, so we're down to the very last, that's always such a bittersweet moment. Well, no, it's just a sad moment. But this is the last one. I was looking forward to these tours for weeks and now we're down to the last. Uh, Ashling. I thought I saw you down here, but maybe not. Um, there, wait, oh, that's the family to go with it. That's amazing, actually. And then this is the, ha oh my God, are you seeing this? I'm glad you guys love the siding because that's one of those things I love seeing in real life. So I always go, I should pop that in the Sims. Yeah, well, it really works. Sometimes I find it really difficult to see like, to like use, aspects that I see in real life in The Sims. It sometimes just doesn't work, but you make this work so well. Um, can be placed anywhere, snow or no snow. Okay, thank you for letting me know. I love this with the snow though, so I think I'm gonna place it in um, Mount Kamarebi. And also you only use three packs? That's amazing. Um, I only caught the last half of today's tours, so I have the first hour and a half after the, oh yeah! Nice. Um, family farmhouse. A farming uncle steps up and adopts his twin sisters. Two children after a tragic fire took her and her husband's life. Oh my God. 
He converted his office into a room for the older sibling and made a memorial greenhouse for their parents. I only use base game and holiday free pack. Hope you like it. And it's mostly play tested. Oh my God. Wait, yeah. This looks amazing. And so these are the Sims that you made. Uh, Steven or Stefan Faulkner adopted his twin sister, Michelle's two children. Um, Michelle and her husband, Derek, tragically lost their lives in a fire. Uh, Steven is a single farmer who loves the outdoors. He is going to try and raise them well and keep their parents' memory alive. That is so wholesome. Cody and Elena. That is so cute. What a sweet family. Yeah. That makes me like a little bit emotional. That is so cute. Oh my God. I love it. Uh, your cast love red heart mono. Yes, we, we know that. You are so good at cast. It's actually outrageous. Um, I'll place it here. I'm so excited to see this. I love the red color in the snow. For some reason, that, that just hits different. I like to create families for my bills. That is so cool. It makes it so complete. It makes the entire storyline like whole. If that makes sense. It's just so good. Sorry, I was in a call, but great job. Oh, no worries, no worries. Um, tomorrow is Saturday, right? Yeah, tomorrow is Christmas Eve. Right. So it's your last workday before Christmas, Swami. I take it. Um. Free real estate on. Thank you. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> yes, unfortunately, I am working. Yeah, so annoying. Can't they just give you the day off on Christmas Eve's Eve? I feel like they need to give you the day off. It's Christmas Eve's Eve. It's important. I get to use my new air fryer in a little bit. That's exciting. It is, it works so well. It's so quiet. It's actually insane. <gasps> How is this the same shell? Are you kidding me? This is so pretty. Hi, Nessa. How are you? It is so good to see you. We got an email from the CEO saying happy holidays. And I was thinking, oh my God, he is going to tell us it's half a day. Oh my God, he didn't. I miss my old job strictly because I had uh, off from the week of Christmas to New Year's Day. Yeah. The porch. I love wrap arounds. Yeah, this is insane. Are you seeing all this decoration? All this decoration. Uh huh. It's going great. Um, what the? No. <gasps> the memorial greenhouse. Oh my God. Are you seeing this? so cute with a fountain and everything oh my god this is gorgeous this is absolutely amazing we have a hot tub back here and like a, a bar situation with a sink and everything and a little christmas tree Ooh. woodworking bench and everything okay I, I need to check out this porch hang on the wraparound porch is so smart. 
So here we have like the front door situation. And then we have a chess table and a Christmas tree. Oh my God. Oh, and we have a workout corner back here as well. Oh my God. Five ads in a row, that's so annoying. I absolutely love seeing how everyone's brains work and they turn the same walls into so many different things. That is legitimately so cool. I love that about Shell Challenges. <gasps> Look at this one. The little seating area and everything. Oh my God, that's gorgeous. And then we have another dining table back here as well. And we have a grill. Um, Twitch has been pretty rough with ads. That's very true. So annoying. Uh, look at this, a little play area out here as well. He really is doing the best he can, huh? Okay. Yeah, so I currently, uh, I, well, I actually sub to people I watch all the time, though I know not everyone has that option. Yeah, makes it so rough. Um... Excuse me, look at this, look at this layout. You sized down this tree? That is 10 out of 10. That is so freaking cool. That's freaking amazing. The gold Christmas tree is gorgeous. It goes seamlessly with the color scheme in here. And then we have all this clutter by the front door, even down here. That's stunning. Uh, living room situation as well. Oh my God, you made your own fireplace? With candles? Are you kidding me? Okay, favorite thing, writing it down on the list. That's crazy. I can't believe it. We have a little jukebox back here as well. Look at this, the painting with the decorations. That is really, really, really smart. Really smart. And up here as well by the desk. And this. All the plants and the colors and the lighting, it all just works together like so well. That's amazing. I wanna go through this archway first. Um, I want to visit this place in real life. Yeah, honestly, me too. Those candles in the fireplace. Yeah, did you size down a window? That is a... I think it's... A, it's an archway, I think. Like, half an archway? Probably. Placed in a basement and then, like, raised up or something like that. Really smart. Oh, you learned it from Pug Owned. Nice. Nice. Fantastic builder. Yeah, very true. Um, okay, so over here we have the kitchen. I am so amazed. I am so amazed. All these builds make me want to build, but I'm too sick to get out of bed. I'm so sorry. That is so annoying. How are these people so talented? I know, it's absolutely outrageous. Look at this kitchen. The level of detail in here with all the wall decorations. And I love this, like how it like sticks out a little bit and then there is a back door here. That is super cozy, I love that. And then here we have the dining room. Also, Shay, thank you for the YouTube sub. I really appreciate it. Um, that mug rag is one of my favorite items. Yeah, I love that one with the mugs. That's really cute. Look at this table placement and then like the china cabinet and the end table back here. Oh my God. And I, I never use these pots and pans hanging from the ceiling. I just don't think they exist. I just, I don't think to use them. I forget they exist, but that looks stunning in here. It's, it fits seamlessly. 
Uh, where do we go next? Oh, so here we have a bedroom. Ooh, that's pretty. Uh, with a uh, with a little easel like painting setup. Oh my God, look at this desk. No way. That is really cute, like a makeshift little desk with a bookcase. That's absolutely adorable. Yeah, it's really realistic, the dining room, I agree. Everyone, or everything in this house is super realistic, I gotta say. Look at this, like, dresser situation as well, and the little violin. Oh my god. Um, Vanessa, thank you for the YouTube sub as well. Sorry I had to step away for a moment. This bedroom is so cute and cozy. I know, right? And then here we have a little bathroom. Ooh, this is so bright. I love the colorfulness in the bathroom. You guys really know how to like make a bathroom more interesting. That is so pretty with a cabinet in the middle. No. No trolls, please, or no bots, please. Thank you, Womi, thank you. Um, so, <clears throat> so how was the, oh, right, the stair was placed, the staircase was placed with a half wall. That is really smart, too. Love that. I love builds with stories because it's so easy to see the little details and what they all mean. Yes, exactly. I love the red doors, too, by the way. That is such a cool touch, and it, like, seamlessly goes with the exterior of the house. Um, first of all, this bathroom layout, again, such a wacky sh size or shape, but it works so well. With a toilet, you, like, placed a little, oop, a little cabinet to fill up the space a bit. That is really, really, really smart, and it looks so good. Um, thank you. Do we have some, like, bots coming in? Thank you, mods. I appreciate it. The shelf behind the toilet. Yeah. It's really freaking genius. We have some toys up here, and then here we have the little toddler's room and a baby bassinet as well. Look at this toddler's room. It is so cute and colorful and cheerful and just... Oh my god, to think that the uncle did this for the kids who lost their parents, that is like, that's so touching. So precious, that is exactly what it is. Oh my god, and all the wall decorations and everything, and all the toys everywhere. That is, there is no way, this is so cute. They popped up like 15 minutes ago and I forgot to ban them when I deleted them. Oh, all right. Well, thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Um, oh my God. Is this the sister? Oh my God. This bedroom, it's all Christmassy and cute. Oh, we found the gnome too. And another fireplace. Oh my god, I freaking love it. Gnome spot it. Yep, we got him. <laughs> Tissues on the bedside table, a wise man. <laughs> yes. <laughs> a wise man. <laughs> Sorry, that just made me a little... Uh, May! Hi! Oh my god, we toured your shell and we all cried because this was so good. Oh my god, we loved it. Um, tours are going so well. Right there, it's me. It's me. How are you, May, my love? How are you? It is so good to see you. We're actually down to the very last one. This is the very last one. It's me. Huh. <laughs> I, the problem, it's me. Why? <laughs> Why did that scare me so much? Very unnecessary. Yeah, May, oh my God, it was so pretty. 
if I remember correctly, what most of us said was, um, how well you worked with like the white and still made it look so warm and cozy inside. Like that was really, really, I mean, you're a freaking talented builder, but that was really, really well done. Yeah, it looked like snow, right? Um, but look at this bedroom. It's so like red and green and cozy. And you can really feel the storyline throughout this whole house, if that makes sense. Like it is so well done. It is so amazingly put together. The colors are fantastic. I love this tree with the lights in it. And I love this half wall by the staircase as well. Um, yeah, the green wallpaper in the uncle's room is really something different. And like the wraparound porch, this is a farmhouse. Like there is no mistaking. Like this is, this is a farmhouse made out of my wacky stupid shell that looks nothing like a farmhouse. But you managed to make it look like a farmhouse. And let's just go into this greenhouse one more time. The memorial greenhouse. Are you kidding me? With all the plants. That is just so precious. I can't believe it. The big porch is stellar. Yeah. It looks so cozy and Christmassy. I know. But also a, uh, a mention of the story that you made for for it. Yeah, and the details in the house that accented the storyline. Exactly. I don't know how to use words anymore after the stream, but that is exactly what I was trying to say. Um, Stellar. Absolutely stellar from every angle. I can't get over this. I love the little trees by the pathway, too. Um, Scorpio wins. Thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome, my love. So, first of all, a huge round of applause. And also, can we get a little moment for the wreath around this round window? That is freaking precious. Such an incredible build. I love the story and home. Yeah, meld together, exactly. The best uncle in the world. Yeah, best uncle award goes to Steven because what the heck? Um. So, favorite part is... I am going to have to go with the self-made, like the, 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 yeah, I guess self-made like fireplaces with the candles. I think that's freaking genius. And the porch, the wraparound porch with the roofing you did. And the greenhouse, all of it, <laughs> all of it. Uh, yeah, and all the decorations on the inside too absolutely freaking stunning um utilizing an uh, awkward wall placement with your stupid one by one room <laughs> that was demanded by olive actually i think she wanted a tower and she didn't want to shut up about it so i gave her a tower <laughs> like a little chimney a one by one <laughs> All of it is a brat. Yeah, I, I agree with that. Um, I can't believe it, but that was it for the shells. I have been looking forward to this for weeks, freaking weeks, and now it's over. So that sucks. Um, we got to do a different or like a new shell challenge in the new year, obviously. So I'm excited for that. Uh, but uh. Yeah, thank you all so much for taking part in the shell challenge and like sharing your amazing creativity and talent with the community and have us look at them and be amazed. It's actually crazy to me. Um, and thank you, uh, Ri Rihanna's, Rihanna's check. Thank you so much for the follow, I appreciate it. Um, the shell challenges are one of my favorite parts of the of being a subbed here. Ah, yeah, I love the shells. They're so good. Um, the last two streams have been so much fun. I know this was a chat full of lovely people, but also have enjoyed how funny and creative you all are too. Agreed, agreed. 
You guys are so good and it's so cool to see how vastly different. Yeah. Yeah, everyone is so talented. Um, we have to say goodbye to the little reindeer. This has been my last stream before Christmas, my loves. I have yet to figure out my schedule for like after Christmas. Uh, for the week after that. I think there'll be a couple less streams because I'm also like going to visit Mr. Simri's grandparents on a on the on Friday, I think. And then I think I I think I'm going to stream for a few hours on the 31st. Um, because New Year's Eve is always so weird. And in the afternoon for me and like morning for most of you, I mean, why not just go live and like stream for a bit, like play some Sims or whatever. Uh, whisper at you, but no pressure at all. Okay. Um, is it something? Hang on. Uh, oh yeah. No, that's good. Uh, I don't know if I follow them. Hang on, hang on. Also, thank you, Elisa. Thank you so much for the follow. I really appreciate it. Just do what works the best for you. Yeah, I need to just figure it out, but streams are gonna be maybe a little bit all over the place next week after the holidays. Um, I think I follow Plumbelina, don't I? I'm fairly certain that I do. Oh my God. <laughs> you open Twitch and everything starts making sounds. Um, Merry Christmas or whichever holiday you celebrate, everyone. Yes, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. And oh my God, I don't even know where to begin. I'm wishing you all the most amazing Christmas if you celebrate and otherwise the most amazing weekend. I will not be here over the weekend um, because Christmas, uh, but I'll be back either on Monday or later next week. I don't know, but I'll keep you posted in the Discord, my loves. I love you all so, so very much. And I enjoy, or uh, I can't speak. I appreciate your um, support so, so, so very much. I love you all so much. We're gonna go say hi to Plumbelina. I will obviously be in the Discord also, but uh, yes, I'm going to be wishing you all an amazing, magical, beautiful Christmas with all your loved ones. Whether that be family, friends, pets, whatever it is that you wanna do. Uh, I'm trying to copy my own rave message. <laughs> Come on. Yes, there we go. <laughs> um, there we go. Perfect. Let's copy over a rave message and let's go say hi to Plumbelina, everyone. Um, have a wonderful holiday, friends. Yes, I love you all so much. Once again, thank you so much for hanging out with me and enjoying all these amazing shells with me. I had the most fun. I love you. We're gonna go say hi to Plumbelina. I'll see you later. I will talk to you later. Have a magical Christmas. I love you. Merry Christmas. Goodbye.